Hey guys, welcome to GaryCon 2019. I am so excited to be here. This is like the first super pro live stream. It's very sussy. And um, we are going to jump into our game very shortly, but I'm gonna just do a little gloating. I got a cool death save shirt. It's custom. This is Dungeon Master and also Kapow! Hey! Phoenix on it. I'm very excited. And so, and you'll never see me in a t shirt unless it's a Death Saves t shirt. So, we are going to jump into the game. We're going to introduce our friends first. We'll start with Kyle. Hi, I'm Kyle Hoke. What do you um, play? I'm playing the drummer of our crew. His name is Khan, Gary Khan. <laughs> he is a uh, 1T sorcerer. Cool. Stefan. Oh, I am Sharmon the Magnificent. Sharmon. Sharmon. Magnificent. I am a halfling and samurai. <laughs> and I play the bass. <laughs> <laughs> I am Sure Shot. Pa pa pa. I'm a tabaxi ranger. And I'm also the manager of this band. The manager. The manager. manager. <laughs> Hi, I'm Nora Ibrahim from Seventh House Studios, and I am going to be playing Flamey Winehouse, the Fire Genasi Warlock singer. And I am Chris Lindsay uh, from Wizards of the Coast, and I will be playing Phyla Damore, also called Amore. The gnome monk bard sidekick. Dude. Goodness. Nice. Goodness. Hi, I'm Jason Charles Miller from Gating Sundry and also Sirens of the Realms. Um, I will be playing Ziggy Free Cloud, the lead singer of our group. And I've decided that his uh, his mentor is named Elvin John. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, that's that's good. I'm Satin Phoenix, Dungeon Master of Sirens of the Realms, community manager of Dungeons and Dragons. And we are going to begin. Now, I Dungeon Master a little bit differently than a lot of people. We're going to do some role, quick role play to figure out where the heck you guys came from. You guys have been playing together for about a year. And halfway through the year... Wait, did you guys figure out why you decided to start a band together? Just we were feeling the, feeling the spirit. Feeling the spirit. What was that? Uh, Music brought us together. That party we were at, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Party. yeah. yeah. Party. You, you were doing all this crazy. It was a good party. option instead of going to jail. Oh, I mean, yeah. Yeah. No, there's the that. Jail is not an option. <laughs> <laughs> now, you guys used to have a seventh band member. Yeah. Shh. Who is this person? Class, race. Um, this is improv. We're the, doing this live. Was the Dro uh, backup singer who, who was competing with you for lead singer and the attitude just got too big? Yeah. Too much ego, uh, man. Dusky. Well, this person's still in the band right oh, really? at this moment. Yeah. Uh, Dusky Dale. Dusky Dale. But did anyone else like him? No. And you guys didn't even like him? Mm -mm. He, had his, really. he had his moments, but. Why'd you keep him around for like six months? He had, he had the money. He, he, he was the money. He was literally just keep showing up. He also had a sweet We connection. told him to leave and he just kept, yeah. he kept getting us all these gigs in the underdark. Yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> the, the, well, the underground clubs, of course, is where yeah. we all played. Mm -hmm. That's where you got to your start. Yeah. He said it was a sidekick and he took it literally. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so. It was those drow shrooms. Oh, yeah. the shrooms. Yeah. Okay, so. He was funding the whole thing, and you guys are like, eh, you know, whatever. Six months, you're practicing, you're getting better and better. Finally, he gets you a gig in Baldur's Gate. By the way, you're from Waterdeep. But he gets you this gig in, in Baldur's Gate. But your caravan, like, you spent a lot of money training you guys, getting you practiced up. Uh, you guys are on a very slow caravan down to Baldur's Gate, and you had to stop for the night. You went into the forest as you do in a fantasy game. <laughs> you go into the forest, you camp out, the night seems real nice. When suddenly, out of nowhere, a monster comes in, a big mutated monster. What is this monster? Ready, go. Atiok. A what? Atiok. What's that? That's the Atiok. things with the tentacles yeah. and little eyes on the stalk that he could garbage. Could be a Neo Atiok. Well, he's not that new. Okay. Well, no, we're, go we're going to add. We're adding on. Add on to it. It's mutated. What's wrong with it? 
it, 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 Oh, I, uh, this is a water deep sewer yeah. sewage uh, one. It's Fle- um, all the stuff that got flushed out of Black Sass Tower was chewing on and got mutated by magic. They, See, yeah. there you it go. It was like a uh, lab otiog. Lab otiog. Like, they it eat made it garbage. Intense. We know this. They eat garbage, and once a month they do a caca, and it's <laughs> it, it's about it's the size it's about the size of a walnut, and it's highly prized by uh, <laughs> alchemists. Yeah. And magic uses for its Every magical color. properties, but it's highly toxic. You gotta pick it up with prongs. You can't touch it. Luckily, I'm not Once affected by poison, so that really isn't yes, a thing. Yes, we we know so, this in the yeah. yeah. There you go. This monster comes in and he's and he chases you guys, leaving your camp into deeper into the forest, way way deeper. Each of you loses something on your character sheet. Oh. Mm-hmm. What is that thing you lose? Oh, if you're no. awesome about this and lose something important, you get advantage on, or you get inspiration. Yeah. I lost the healing potion. Wow. I lose a dagger. All right. Wow. Inspiration, inspiration. I lost a yeah. shield. A shield? Yeah. <laughs> a whole shield? No, whole inspiration. Shield. <laughs> I lost my bedroll. Oh, inspiration. Nowhere to sleep. I lost one of my musical instruments. Whoa! Oh, flute. Oh, jeez. Inspiration. I lost my cooking have? gear. Your cooking gear? <laughs> you also have inspiration. I so you guys are cook. running. And you're running, and you're running, and you're running, and then all of a sudden you're trapped against a big, flat stone wall. But also, you're in a really dense forest, but this big wall has you trapped behind it. Now, somebody sacrifices themselves. There's seven of you. Who sacrifice themselves to let the rest free? Dusky. Dusky. <laughs> the guy we hate. Yeah. <laughs> he, he sacrificed himself by us volunteering him. <laughs> wow, Kyle. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen this side of you before. I, I, I'm, a, I'm a long tea man. I, oh, that's true. I've never seen you play again. He went over to pick up my, my, my shoes, and he fell over my body. That's our story, and we're sticking to it. And then, he, then we ran. And then... Wow. You just ran. couldn't keep up, so... Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, behind the run where you don't have legs. We so, thought about going back and getting them, but did then we did. Did you really? <laughs> we did. We did think about it. it was For On the way out. On the way out, we <laughs> <thought> <laughs> <about> <laughs> it. <laughs> like, did you get the money? Oh, oh man, maybe we should go back. Oh, no. no. <laughs> so you guys are running. And you run and you run. You run all night. And you, as you're, like, when you first leave him, you see this tentacle wrap around. And it just, it, the whole thing envelops him. But you're running, the trees and foliage cover him up, and you, you don't know what happened to him. You make your way down to Baldur's Gate to the tavern you're supposed to meet, him, meet up with him at. And you're supposed to be there on a Friday. You get there, you're supposed to perform on a Friday. You get there on a Monday. You wait. First day, doesn't show. You wait. Second day doesn't show. You wait, third day, you ran out of money, doesn't show. And you have to starve for the next four days, still doesn't show, but you do your performance, you make a little bit of money. What is your band's name? The Runners. <laughs> <laughs> dusky and the Runners. We, yeah. No, no, Dusky, just the Runners. Now it used to be Dusky and the Runners. Now it's now just, now just the Runners. runners. <laughs> and now yeah. is it, it was dusky just the Runners? runners. We yeah, just the runners. The whole, just the runners. Yeah. Just All right. the runners. Yeah. Yeah. It used to be just, just, the just the runners. <laughs> it used to be Dusky and the Midnight Runners. And now, now we're just, just the, the runners. runners. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Just the runners. Now at this event, six months you've been playing together. At this event, there was another group there. You knew who this group was. They're famous across all the Forgotten Realms. They are called the Shadow. Oh yeah, I used to bootleg their stuff. Yeah, they're like totally cool. You know, these elves are like six foot three, and they're all, they all look the same. They all have long, dyed black hair. They're the Shadowfell. And you guys have been looking up to them for a really long time. They're cool. They make a ton of money doing what they love, playing gigs. 
Is that what you're doing? <laughs> 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 so mysterious. So, so, so I would be like this, yeah. right? I really yeah, wish I could have like long black hair like them, but I just got this flaming situation. Is it short? And every flaming? time I try to wear a wig, it just bursts into flames. I have yeah. the same problem when I try to grow my hair out. I tend to burn it off. Yeah. It sucks. I look up wow, to you guys have hair. Half <laughs> <laughs> I can give you hair. Oh no, it's okay. Okay. So you guys performed. And the, the pain or the relief <laughs> of losing <laughs> this person made you play better than you've ever played before, and you caught the eye of the Shadowfell. And they came up to you and, and basically said that they would love to mentor you. And they took you under their wings, and the next six months, they trained you even further. Now, each one of you related to one of these, these uh, performers. What was their name, and why did you relate to them? Yeah, Elvin John. Elvin John. He, he was the <laughs> singer. He was just enamored by his, his abilities and wanted to get better. What was what was your favorite song of his? Um, <laughs> it was uh, Magic Mizzle Man. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, well, mine didn't have a, a best song, but he was also a hype man. And I really I really looked up to Mac. Uh, his name was Mac, Mac Lovin. And um, he was really smooth with the ladies, and I wanted to be just like him. Nice. It's true. He had a great beard. Mm -hmm. I'm working on it. <laughs> An elf with a beard. I'm, in it. I'm into it. I'm into it. <laughs> magic, man. Magic. magic. It's a magic beard. Don't judge. <laughs> Mine was Flair, formerly from the duo Sunny and Flair. And, uh, you know, I just always really looked up to her, and I think she, like, really, like, her career just took off, and she really came into her own, and I really admired that. Plus, I love her outfits. Yeah. And, like, the really, like, inspiration. Uh, like, I love the song, If I Could Turn Back Town. I always thought it was time, <laughs> but I asked her once, and she said, no, it's time. <laughs> I can turn back town. So, um, that was a... Uh, so I, I really looked up to her nice. after that. Um, I The manager yeah. is like who I aspire to be. I don't know her name, and uh, she doesn't like me. Because she says she doesn't like me, so I'm immediately drawn to her. Is she allergic? And I always just try to like get on her lap and just sit next to her and sit really close to her. And wherever she goes, I like to go. And she wears this really pretty shiny necklace, and I just always want to touch it. She's so shiny. <laughs> and she's just kind of... She hates your guts. <laughs> <Loser>. <laughs> like, I don't understand why you would hate me. I'm such a pretty kitty. <laughs> oh, uh, I look up to Nisha because she's the only one that talks to me. Uh, <laughs> you know, I like her. She gives me tension. That's it. You know, not many people care about me because they think I'm <laughs> kind of, you know, rough. I don't know. And, I mean, I'm a halfling, but you know, I am a samurai, and uh, but I'm not very good with people. But Nisha, she, she talks to me. So the way you two met, everyone else just latched on, but the two of you are just kind of standing against the wall, very quietly together. She looked down at you. Oh. Hey. Yeah, you. How's it going? I'm okay. Uh, you know, you're very tall. It's pretty cool, right? You're very cool. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah, and then that's how your relationship <laughs> of your friendship. <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, and now you're friends. Um, I bonded with Johnny Quicksticks, their drummer, mostly because I had the bootleg of their first album, which he didn't have. So I actually got him the album he was missing. And I like him because he actually taught me how to drum because up until then I had no clue. You I knew was that. like a real Just, mentor. <laughs> yeah, so I was like a real band drummer. Yeah. And so finally I learned how to play the drums. And nice. That's why I like them. So you guys have been traveling with them. You, you've opened for them a couple times. And this, this moment that you are in right now, a year later, they've taken you down to a place that's just south of Waterdeep called... The Sword Costica, a little small village south of Waterdeep on the water. And they um, 
You are in a tower. You're in a, a, an inn. You're in an inn in this little village, and you're just um, practicing. You know you're about to perform in this place, and the place is a uh, temple of Lathander. And you heard that it was a friend of theirs is the priest there, and they're doing a big charity event for the orphanage. In the basement? No. Oh, it's okay. in the temple. It's like in the temple. And he, they're very excited. You know they have this like super emo exterior, but they're actually really good guys. Um, so they're about to show up to introduce you to this priest, and you're going to go off to this big charity event. It is, there's nobles from all over the place coming to visit to watch you perform. This is your, the, your, the centerpiece of this. There are other performers, but you are the centerpiece. So you're in this room. You're warming up. I don't know what you do when you warm up. Warming up doesn't mean catching on fire. Fine, <laughs> and I just like to do it. A bit. <laughs> All right. So, is our next gig after this at uh, Sword Costa Rica? Yeah, I think so. Okay, I gotta look it up. Uh, yeah. I was to say. Is that? No. You just yes. tell me where to go, and I show up. Let me check my papers. That's sure gonna get you in so much trouble. <laughs> Yes. All right, you Go. guys are warming up, and all of a sudden, the door swings open. The wind. And all, it's a small room, it's probably about this big, and they kind of fit through the door, but there is the shadow fell. And as they walk in, they stand in the line, and, and you kind of just see in front of you, like, the words, like, almost as if they're magical. Shadow fell. I throw up a uh, minor illusion of people applauding. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Hey guys, we're really excited to, to you know launch today with you. We're, we're really proud of you, and um, and each one of your mentors comes up to you, but they're kind of all move at once. Do they float? They almost float. Yeah, they almost yeah. float. And they come up to each one of you and they hand you something. I'm sorry, I don't have any with me. Um, they eat, hand you each what looks like a crystal on a necklace. Oh, shiny. Is this your new merch? And she kind of just throws her hand. <laughs> <laughs> this is for you. We believe in you. We think that you guys are ready to go off on your own and really make a name for yourself. Yeah. Don't eat it. There's something fishy going on here. You, could, you guess you could use this for fishing. Oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, we want to introduce you to Reginald. Reginald's the priest, and they all part. like. And there's this little old man just standing there. He's got gold rings. He's got gold chains. And he also has a priest of Lathander like robes on. The big morning, morning uh, sunrise. It's like red with a gold or rose colored with gold sunrise emblem. Oh, I've heard so much about you. It's very nice to meet you. Reginald, it's so nice for you to have us here. We appreciate it. Oh, oh thank you so much. Um, the children are very happy. You're going to raise a lot of money. Now, there's a lot of VIPs here, and I want to make sure you do really good. Do you need anything? I can't let them down. They're going to give us a lot of money. Uh, um, what can we use? Uh, um, food? Food? What's food? food? It's a VIP. We don't, sorry. <laughs> Pegasus. I think that's what it means. Cool. What? VIP. He asked me what it means, and I think it means very important Pegasus. Well, we could get one. Is that what you need? Uh, no, no, no. That's oh, okay. Um, do you have any questions before we go in? Have you ever been into a temple of Lathanda? No. No. They oh. tend to not let me near temples. Why not is that? Only. Busy. I'm usually busy. That's very confusing. Oh. Smash. Oh. oh. Idols. Oh, Dude. yeah, don't. Don't do that. Oh, Please fine. don't do Good that. Good tip. Thank you. And he's like, he grabs his <laughs> jewels. <laughs> it's like really. And you see, he's got gold on him, but yeah, definitely jewels, and he's like covering them. No, not those. No, not those. I'm very confused. Is it, uh, you're the band manager, yes? That's right. Um, <laughs> darling, come with me. Um, we're all going now, so grab whatever you need. We're going to go. Let's go. Okay. And so, um, He's walking and talking with you and just telling you about the church and how great it is and how much money they raise and how wonderful uh, a life following uh, 
you know, the the god is. The pay well? It pays very well. Hey, pay. Hey. Well, could I do like an insight check on this dude? Yes. What are you looking for? I just want to make sure he's trustworthy. This is my band. It's just something, just something about him. You smell him a little bit? My hat <laughs> go up. All right, insight. <laughs> Fifteen. You definitely feel like he's compensating. Mm -hmm. There's something. This, you you, you want to like keep an eye on him because okay. there's something happening. Yeah. So what got you into being this uh, charity thing? Why? What? Were you like an orphan? Well, it's very lucrative. Uh -huh. um, there is that. Also, you know, the god, we like to make sure the young ones uh, have what they need to move forward in life. And so this is a win-win for everybody. Uh -huh. Makes us look good. The babies grow up and they give us uh, their money. It's a very nice thing that we're doing. Who are these VIPs? Oh, they're nobles from all over. Yes. Um, the locals, they kind of stand outside. It's a very big church we have. They stand outside and they get to watch from the windows, but inside all VIPs, they pay a lot of money to be there. So don't mess up. So I am asking if you need anything. You want some water? And he goes, as you guys walk up to the church. You some mead. Uh, Noted. I can't perform without any long bottom leaf. Long bottom mm -hmm. leaf. We definitely, oh, we, I'll give you some of my private. And then he pulls out of his robes um, a pipe and it's one of those like, and he hands it to you, and it's already packed. Is that the water weird pipe? Yeah. <laughs> Not too much before the performance. <laughs> yeah, you gotta keep your mushrooms down, man. You can't be doing that. We're always behind on the beat. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the two needs to lock together. <laughs> I know where the beat is because he needs to lock in with you. He smokes too much of that. It's all over the place. So he opens the door and he actually leads you guys through. Um, as you can see here, we have a temple. Um, but the people aren't there yet. I just can't reach that far. You guys walk in through this away, and they put you in a waiting room. And he, he snaps his fingers, and these um, page boys come out, and they have water, they have wine, they have everything that you seem to need nice. all ready for you there, and they walk you into this room. Do you guys know which characters you are? Because mm. I do. Yes. yes. Okay. Oh, Not that one. Ah, that's me. You really see me? But yes, I know which one I am. Okay. Can we move these tall pieces, please? Our lovely assistant, moving us away. Magic. Oh, yeah. Oh, nope. Oh, nope. Gotta lose it. Nope, nope. It's good. Nope. Oh. Next time. Thanks for having Cool. There you go. Thank you. I know a little bit about this. Really? <laughs> <laughs> you know, you can probably, probably tell these guys a few things. Beautiful. Thank you. So oh, that's you. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. So you're in this holding area. You hear that there is, you can't see them because I have a problem with putting too many minis in one place and it confuses me. So imagine if you will, use your mind's eye. There are tons of people in the pews, tons of people. And they're talking and waiting and they've got wine and, and you hear the glasses clinking and everyone's having a wonderful time. And um, the shadow fell, take each one of you and, and they say, uh, we have to go in and we have to do a speech, but um, when you hear us start applauding, so there's going to be an applause when we walk in because that's just what happens. But the second applause, that's for you. Uh -huh. And you're going to walk right in the middle of the room and you're going to perform. And everyone's going to watch. And it's going to be great. No pressure. And then you hear the priest, oh. Hey, Elvin, are we supposed to wear these necklaces? Yes, wear the necklaces. They look really great. And you should all have something matching. As you see, they are all matching. Mm -hmm. Can I detect magic on this? You sure can. Why does this feel like a setup? Because it feels like a setup. It does. If we're walking into it, yeah. So I don't think we should go in there, guys. So, uh, no, I'm paranoid. Because that, you know, long bottom. Okay, it, it has, is magic. It makes me paranoid. Oh, that's right. You just cast it. That's right. <laughs> you just cast it. Like Can I cast Identify on it? You sure can. Uh, yes. It takes a little time. we got time, right? Right. How long does it take? Um, 
Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. One minute. No, it takes one minute. That's much better. No, I was really hoping you were just saying that. Minute. Okay, so the priest walks in, cheers. Everybody stands up. You can hear the pews <sighs> moving a little bit as people are standing and cheering. And he walks in. And as uh, you see the double doors open and you see him walk up the stairs, um, here they're already there. And we're going to use our, um, the minis we have here are uh, skeletons, mm -hmm. the reapers. Those are going to be the shadow fell. Okay, good. Oh. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's, That's all, all the <laughs> <all I'm worried laughs> about. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah, yeah, they're instruments. Yeah, they're uh, yeah. instruments and they're in all disguise. Mounted. In uniform. Exactly. Right. Yeah, so nice. that's projected. OK. And then the priest is going to be the man with the lantern. So mm -hmm. um, he goes up there. He turns around, does this big gesture, and the shadow fell just unfold up the door. And they glide forward, and people are ooing and aahing and applauding. The doors close behind you. Be we're, are we, we're still in here. You're still in there. We're in here or in here? You're, you're staying right there. Okay. Yeah. But the doors close. These doors. And you hear the priest, no. he's giving a no. speech about the he's children. Doors. You kind of hear it muffled through the door. And then um, you hear the shadow fell, the, their whispering voices also talking about stuff. Everyone roll perception checks. You can hear what they're saying. Mm -hmm. Oh. You've, been, you've been playing too close to the, the speakers for way too long. <laughs> All right. I, can't hear them. Uh, I only got a 16. Mm. I have four. Nice. <laughs> Ten. Okay. I only got a 16. Okay. Nine. 14 and 16. You definitely hear them talking about uh, experiences, shared experiences, uh, histories with orphans, uh, a lot of something about rescuing orphans. And. Um, Is it res rescuing or sacrificing? Oh, okay. It's a difference. Yanti. Oh. Um, and then. That's our last tour. <laughs> and then you hear your name. Just the runner! Sure, shut jumps in front of the door. I need to fix that. Just keep running. I don't think we should go out there. Hey. We can't go out there. It's cool. I'm your manager. Brace on okay, it is well. a, a protection. Necklace of protection. Oh. Uh, you get a plus to your AC and saving throws while, while wearing it. Nice. It's not a big chance. It's not below You don't it. go out there anyway. You just stay out for the side. Oh, I don't think you guys should go out there. But this we is gotta a big go out chance. there. It's our big break. Something weird about this. This is something we wanted. Runners. Kick the door open. Kick the door open. Okay, you, I go open. underneath her arm. Because I'm... You know, <laughs> and I push the door open like this. And... <laughs> and, uh, and I kind of like dance a little bit out of the... the Start waving out. Yeah. I throw it around. I point at the door. Oh. And stuff. Which guy? Which one? Are you? So you got sparks coming out of your fingertips. Yeah. Pew, pew, pew. And the cat or tabaxi friend <laughs> is standing in, in the doorway like this, tails twitching. <laughs> yep. Tail. Yep. <laughs> this is our dancer. Hello. What are you guys doing? What else should you be doing? Uh, I'm waving with burning hands. As you walk it's out like to the, the, the Oh the my god. Of the <laughs> All right, move everyone to the middle. I'm going to um, throw, throw up a nice roaring loud applause to buffer the, the noise of there with the illusion to make it seem it's happening better. Mm. <laughs> you're, you're standing there and roll Arcana. And what you're going to do is you're going to try to regulate the sound. You're going to be the mixer, the sound. Uh, and I only got a dirty 20. You're so good at this. <laughs> uh, practice in a lot of churches. Uh, the acoustics are good, but you know sometimes things get louder and softer. So you're live mixing this. That's what drummers do, and I don't have to worry about it because I can do it with my hands full. All right, so. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, normally we we play a lot of covers, but tonight we're going to play an original composition that my my diminutive friend here and I wrote. Uh, it is about a. A, a, a uh, woman that we knew long ago who, who had a dungeon, a, a, a dungeon mistress, you might say. Uh, it, it, what, what, what? I'm going to give him an echo to his voice so it sounds even more impressive. Uh, this is called uh, Hey Dungeon Lady. <laughs> Walk the halls you guard 
so close What happens when they're gone Traps were laid and glyphs were cast Until the rope came along I've been all across this dark land Looking for the reason I still shadow fell, these black purple portals opened up and these creatures stepped out and everyone was focused, so focused on this amazing performance. I love you so much. I love you, meow, meow. Um, so focused. You're standing there and, and you've been booming. You've been booming their voices that nobody could hear and the screaming and, and applaud, applause was so strong that um, the screaming kept going and it wasn't until you stopped that you looked around and realized little black portals had been opening up around and these zombies what? What? were coming up out of the ground oh, and started nabbing and gnawing on, at, on these nobles and the screaming was also the screaming of the nobles as some of them pushed past you and let's see what happens here. We've got, um, we ha do we have the big bad ones for the, the upper part? So oh, as you, um, they're performing, <laughs> they're playing, ones. they're hearing. Is there anything that you want to do to get their attention? Your friends I, I'm trying to scream and call their names. You feel you like guys, turn around! around. No, 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 not now, not now. Uh, uh, <laughs> they're zombies! Turn around! Oh, Rob Zombie's zombie. playing later. <laughs> <laughs> um, the groove man. <laughs> We need to rethink this song. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's, 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 it's the bridge. Needs you, another verse. Can I run up to them? <laughs> the, the you can run up to them. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're like 15 feet away, 20 feet away. You can run up to them. But they're screaming, continuing around you. And now nobles are running past you. I'm trying to like herd them. Get, move, 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 move. Uh, you whoa, look whoa, up. What? Anybody who's paying attention looks up behind you. And on this upper level, Uh -huh. 
Oh boy. Okay, we need some more bad guys up there. Oh. There should be some. Oh, uh, man. <laughs> Sound like a lot of bad guys. Yeah, those guys. Oh, all, all the bad yeah. guys. Um. So behind <clears throat> each one of the Shadowfell pops up somebody. On the third one in, this hooded man walks up, larger than anyone else. Everyone roll perception checks. See if you can see what is going on up there. 17. Ooh, cool, you do. <laughs> 21. All right, you guys do. 16. Cool. Yeah. I seem to be sitting way no. more than All right, one. you're busy watching the Sign people run. And you're small, you know? Like, people, are oh, you're still playing the bass. <laughs> 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 um, okay. so, so, okay, so you look up, and there's this man who's, who's super gaunt, very skeletal. And he is, he's turns and is, uh, he, he grabs the Shadowfell gentleman in front of him and he has him by the hair and he's talking to the priest you can't hear what they're saying but you see them gesticulating now the guy there's two people who are down there's the um we'll do it like this one two three four five six four and six are down they look they look down so uh, if you can go ahead and put them prone uh, on this side, yeah. over here, yeah. Four. Yeah. Oh, so oh, oh, oh. they are. Oh. So the first one is down, and the Ooh. the creature almost looks like an orc behind it. He's down <coughs> with it, and it looks like he's hovering over it. The one on the very end here looks like he's eating that person. <gasps> like he has a big chunk out oh, of their God. shoulder, whoa. and that person has gone down. Whoa, now the cool. other ones, they're like in, like they're struggling together. So, everybody roll me initiative. Uh, Shadow Phil! Shadow Phil! Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, Shadow Phil! Okay. I'll just stand in the back. Oops. Six. All right, the upper part got a 17, uh, the upper part got a 17, Nine. the lower That's part right. got a three. Ten side. Kyle will be doing initiative today because I have brain damage. Ten. Go 17. He's got 17. Oh, you go first. Nine. Ten. Nine. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Six. Six. Yeah. Ten. Ten. And I got a nineteen. Now the portals are still open behind them. Wow. Yeah. yeah. So, so you mm. Big my dark Nisha. portal. So we'll give him an eighteen so he can go in front of the... Twenty-two is the best. Give him the eighteen. Give him the eighteen. Yeah. Because I have a seventeen as well. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Between the break the tie. Yeah. Um, the place is loud and screaming, and half of the people have already uh, left. Every single zombie down there is on somebody. Let's see if they have. Yes, and they are actually, they have nobles, and they are gnawing on them. Flame is quick starting fire. All right. I am going to uh, poison spray the one right by, like nearest to me. Okay. Let's see. Can you point to that for me? It's very far. Uh -huh. My eagle eyes. These are zombie types? Uh, yeah, this one right here. Okay, go for it. Okay. Uh, that's a con save. That is a one. Oh, sweet. Yes. So I deal 11 damage. Damage. Okay. So just so you guys know, for those of you who haven't played with me, if you roll your dice off the table, you have disadvantage on your next roll. If I roll my dice off the table, I get disadvantage. It's fair. If I roll your dice off the table? I'll fight you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next up. Next up would be me. I'm going to firebolt the one to my left or back there. Firebolt. All right. That one over the It's getting real. Firebolt. Firebolt for a total of 17 to hit. Fantastic. Totally hits. The firebolt <laughs> sets some curtains aflame behind it. Oh, really? <laughs> wow. Uh, for 15 yeah. points of damage. Cool. Okay. Next. Next would be Ziggy. Going to cast Thunder Wave. Yeah. All right. One of those two. Uh, All right. Is it safe? That direction. Yeah, it is a con save against 15. 
I rolled terribly. I rolled a two. Yes. Okay, then I will roll for damage. How far they get now they each have uh, nobles in their arms. Oh, so, they do? Yep. Oops, well. Well, too late. <laughs> you already did it. <laughs> How far do they get? We got that. We'll find out. Is it uh, 5, 10, 15 feet? How back, far back do they get pushed? Okay, it's a 15 foot cube. Um, 10 feet away. Cool. Feet away. <laughs> they hit the wall. All of them. And they they still have a hold on the uh, the creature. And everybody takes only, unfortunately, or fortunately for the nobles, only three points of damage. <laughs> so I roll right. badly, which I guess is good in this situation. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next is that up. both against the wall now? Next oh, up. yeah. So someone wants to push them against the wall. The, the ones those on the far side? Two, because I'm the... Yeah, I'm the blonde guy, so those two. Yeah. yeah. The windows shatter as you hit it. Um, Stained glass. <laughs> next up is the upper deck. All right, upper deck. The two that are prone pick up their the shadow fell, fall backwards into the portals, and their portals close up. With their nobles? Yeah, with no, with, with the, the shadow, shadow fell. fell. Uh, with, oh no! The yeah. band Misha. Man. Um, it's the band man. Misha. Band man. The uh, the priest goes running down the stairs, kind of jumps down, and is. Uh, if you want to move him down underneath, he's trying to open the door. He has this huge ring of keys, and he's, he's trying to open the door. He just totally runs. Now the big guy with the big. Uh, with a really gaunt face, mm -hmm. he has the shadow fall, and anyone who's um, looking around and seeing this, nope, he one. turns this him and he's looking one. into his face and he's saying something. The other ones, let's see. Okay, um, the furthest one uh, seems to have knocked out that one. So, so number one. Number one fell down? Yeah. So he's knocked out. And the middle two are just in fight. We've got the third one down. Whew. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the one, two, three, four, the fifth one is down. Mac! Uh -oh. Yeah. So, oh, all right, next. Next up is Shimon. Shimon, <laughs> wait a minute. What's going down? Uh, I'm going to run. Can I wear my uh, like here? Which yeah. one? Yeah. Which one's that one? So I move. My move is what 25 feet walking. It says. Yeah, you can yeah. move 25 feet. So it's at five. And, and what, how many feet is each square? Five, five foot. Five foot squares. No, uh, can, I, if, can I run past this goblin? What are you not? trying to go to? I'm trying to go up there and All save right. Nisha. Uh, can you put him as close to... Now you want to do a double move, or do you want yes. to... Yes. Okay, so go ahead and move him to the squares. Sa I gotta save my only friend. He can run through the group. Yeah, he can run through the group. And avoid the goblin yeah. types. Mm. Uh, do do I see mm. my friend mm. Nisha up there somewhere? Yeah, he's on the other side. Is it this side? Then I go that okay, way. Okay, so you going to go this way. So to there, so one, two, four, and one, two, three, four, there. Nisha, I'm coming. <laughs> Almost. Sharon is coming. Okay, so you make it right there, and you see this. Go ahead and roll me a perception check, or we're going to find out what you see while you're up there. Ten. You are pretty close, and you're, is that ten, or no, is there more? No, we got more. Uh, uh, your perception? Plus three. Cool. So Thirteen. What you notice, they're wearing these black robes with this, um, the big guy has a huge symbol and it looks like a skull, like a red oh. skull. It's kind of... Red skull? Yeah. It's got this like, and there's like a circle around it. Doesn't it. look good. It's it doesn't good. look good. No. And the rest of them do and you kind of glance back and you notice that uh, the creatures down there also have these shoulder pieces that have that symbol as well. Oh, so you were like up a, there, a you were watching this whole thing happen, and then who's next? After Simone is Amore. Amore, uh, Amore will move from where he's standing, uh, and he kind of twists his little mustache, and he mm. charges forward to this guy. 
uh, right there, and he's like, you messed with the wrong band. Yeah. And he will take a swing at that guy with his closed fist, um, which seems to light up with like magical light. Ooh, so it does yeah. this. Oh. Amori will roll a natural one. <laughs> no! Oh. Mommy damage. Oh. Which band was it? Damage. What is this magic that happens under the hand? It's just, it's just magic. It just is magic? Yeah, so five. You go to hit, and you're next to that pillar, and you plow into the pillar, and you it ripples through your arm, and your arm <coughs> aches for five points of damage. Okay, oh. so um, I smash, and then I'm like, oh, and then as a, um, uh, as a bonus action, uh, I will turn, and I will point uh, to uh, three of my, my favorite band members. Um, <laughs> and I will point to Ziggy, and I will point to, this is you right here, right? Yeah. You. No, 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 I'm sorry. I'm, I'm the one right in the back. back. Oh, you, and then I will point to um, the, you're right here, Mr. Dummer. I'm the one in the back. Yeah, right here. Yeah. Point to you, boom, 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 and you three all get um, uh, five temporary hit points. Nice. And um, uh, each of you can immediately use your reaction to move up to your speed without provoking opportunity attacks. <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs> do your thing! Nice. All right. Okay. Uh, what do you want to do? So the priest is by the door, trying mm -hmm. to unlock it. Do you want to move before the thing? Yep. thing? That's What's your that? movement. You can move right where's, now if you want yeah, to. Yeah, where's your movement? Oh, I can move without doing... Yeah. As your it's reaction, your turn before yet, your turn. But, but right now, if you want to remove, you can move. Yeah, oh, the yeah. Three of you can move. Okay, so then I can move just as like a before I do stuff. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm going to uh, go up right behind him. Yeah. But you can't do anything else but move. You're That's done. It? Yep. It's, it's not it, your turn yet. It's not your turn. This yet. is just a result oh, of the ability yeah. I just did. Gotcha. I thought we were mm -hmm. yeah, back on. Right. Yeah, you, you can move up I would like to um, charge against the two that I, or, you know, the one go get closest the to me. Yep. Ah. Okay. What do you want to do? Um, run me up the other stairs, the one yeah, towards yeah. The, the solo guy with the one on, on the down. Yeah. yeah. This, yep. Yeah. All right. Cool. All right. Who do we have next? And after Amore comes, pow, 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 pow. Okay. Um, uh, you're there. I'm gonna go ahead and who's who's this guy? So the good guy or the bad guy? The yeah. The red, the, the red guy. The red guy's the bad guy. The red guy is the big bad guy. Big red skull. Well, I'm gonna mark him. Do it. And then I'm gonna hit him with my. What does it look like? He's when you mark gonna him? be sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Um, and then we're gonna just go ahead and, and hit him with my bow. Oh, for 20, uh, 28? Oh yes. Okay. That might hit. A little bit. And. You made your Ooh, point. 12, and 13 points of damage. 13 points of damage. He yes. did not like that. Yes. Is this me? Can I jump up here? No. Just for spectacle. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah, why not? Okay. You have climb speed. You can actually just yeah. go there. Oh my god. Uh, if you can't make it, then that's what it looks like. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you get up there, think. And it hits him pah, right in the shoulder. Yeah. yeah. Uh, like, he's holding on to the guy and he looks at you. That's right. Oh. Right into my kitty face. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> <Jesus. laughs> Alright, who's next? Uh back to the top. Now we're back up. Alright, so I'm right behind the priest and I say, now wait a minute. Woo! <laughs> As I cast charm person. Alright. And uh, so. Uh, you're trying to do? The priest. Oh, failed, failed, failed. Alright. <coughs> yes, darling? <laughs> he actually what? says it like this. Yes, darling? <laughs> wow. What? I'm just going in, I'm, I'm just going in here. Just, uh, I just gotta go in, inside. I gotta, I gotta figure out what the hell's going on and how to figure this out. I gotta just go, I gotta... Whose just, side are you on? Uh, I'm, on, I'm on, on your side. I'm on your side. Can you tell me who those people are upstairs? They're bad guys. They're really bad. They're super bad. Uh, we made a mistake, and now it's coming to bite us in the ass. And uh, yeah, this. And he's actually standing up right now. He's not 
with this. Huh. And he's like, uh, yeah, there was just a thing, and um, I, I, I need to go look at my library to figure out um, how to, uh, yeah, can you, are you guys killing those things? Because I think they're eating, and he looks over, and he's like, I think they're eating the VIPs. <laughs> <laughs> uh, bad. Because you guys are adventurers, right? Do you know how they, well, yes. I'll tell you everything, but those, but, um, can you keep me safe? Of course, you okay. can help yeah. us out. Absolutely, absolutely. But um, there's nothing we can do except for, uh, and he like looks up the stairs as things are just, people are getting eaten and things are just blood splattering Gosh. everywhere. Uh, windows Jeez. are shattering and he looks up and he's like, Gosh. yeah, there's, we can't save them here, but we, I can figure out a way, uh, but we just need to, okay. oh boy, oh boy. We're going to talk stuff. later. And then. Okay. <laughs> That's great. Ooh. I learned right. so much. <laughs> uh, next up is me. And from where I am, I'm going to turn. And my favorite boys are getting the haste spells because I'm casting haste on you and I'm twin spelling it on you. Oh. So. Winning. <laughs> <laughs> uh, All right. And then I'll move back. I'll move my, myself the rest of the way up uh, onto the, the platform. Okay. Um, move up to the platform. Please. By the way, you guys getting the haste spells get the following bonuses to you. Can you move him up, please? Oh, yes. He's moving up here. Yep. You get this. Um, until the spell ends, which is for one minute or ten rounds, you guys get your speed doubled, so your movement doubles. Your AC gets a plus two. Oh, nice. And you have advantage on deck saves. And you get one additional action each turn on top of your normal one action. Dang, Kyle. Nice. Uh, one extra turn or? One extra action. action. But that action can only be used to make an attack, physical, a dash, disengage, hide, or use an object. So no spelling. Okay. But you can, you can swing your axes and throw your punches and do the things. All you wish. Yep. Wow. Get them, boys! Yes! <laughs> All right. Next up would be Ziggy. I'm stabbing the zombie right in front of me. No more stabbing. Stab. Stab. Ill, Ill repute. I'm stabbing. Stab, stab, stab. And I get a, a, a 13. 13 totally hits. Great. So you stab. You see this, it's got its arms and it's eating at the uh, noble, and it looks up at you as you're coming towards it. Ah! And uh, you manage to get it right in the neck, uh, avoiding the noble. Yeah, so you hit it for six, and it kind of flinches just from the force, but it still has like a piece of neck in its mouth. <laughs> All right. Whoa. It's a piece like of neck. Piece of neck. Piece of neck. Piece of neck. <laughs> Uh, any other actions, or are we done? Uh, I'm good for now. All right, nice. Next up comes to the upper deck. All right. Mm -hmm. Points directly at you. Yes. He's got the shadow fell on his hand, and he's pointing at you, and you feel something pulling at you for 19 to hit. What, 19 damage? AC? AC is what? 16 right now. Okay. So, make me a constitution saving throw. Oh, wait. It's AC 17 because he's got a protection necklace. That doesn't help. Yeah, no. Okay. So, Dex roll a save. make me a constitution Con saving throw. Roll a d20. So, you see your con up. 10. Plus, what's that in your constitution? Plus 5. Plus one more because of your necklace. 16. Uh, it is just enough. So you take uh, seven points of necrotic damage, and you feel, you actually feel the hit points. Ah! But as it, like, comes to your heart, it you just feel a little bit weaker. Um, and that one looks at you and laughs and releases and then falls back with the mentor oh. into the portal as Does it closes. It be, is Nisha still there? Uh, is that, which one's that? Yeah, Nisha Nisha's was down, the second one. She's the one standing up still. Oh. Okay, ah. so the third one in. Which one just fell? No, that's the first one. So that's one. Yep. No, 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 that one's still there. Well, actually it's not. The They're third, gonna fall back into the third? portal too. Yeah. 
Uh, take them both. So take okay. that one back. And, and the one, hold on. And this so, one here. Um, and that one is out. Oh boy, they're all disappearing. And better shot. And and they're all disappearing through the portal. This guy. Yeah. That the guy goes. Oh, five go. he's gone. Oh, let's take no, he's a bad boy. Uh, there is number two left and the portal behind him. There is, what is that, five? Five, that's, yeah. There is five and the portal behind him. That five is now eating. Eating? Um, that guy. Who's that? That's your guy. Yes, that's Mac. Oh, yeah, he's eating him. It's still alive. Oh, he looks still like he's alive. actually, he's distracted and enjoying. So, actually, he's prone. They're both prone because he's he's now focused and down. Um, the other two, I think they're, let's see. Uh, yeah, so they're actually up and just fighting. Yeah, they're in fisticuffs. So there's only two portals left up there with those creatures and your friends. So now who goes next? After the upper, upper deck, we come all the way down to Shimon. Yes! <laughs> Yes, Smoon. I am super speedy, and I see Nisha, and I say, I'm coming for you. And I <laughs> 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 All right. <coughs> Who is that? Uh, so bad that guy looks person. like he kind of looks like an ogre, but he mm. looks kind of like a zombie. Kind of looks like a zombie ogre. I'm, I'm charging, right? I'm going to yep. charge up and hit. Run, plus five bonus, the attack's damage. Yeah. So. And, I'm gonna do. and if you hit him, you can With my two. great axe. And I leap. And as I swing the axe at its head, whatever it is. It's oozing. It's Eight oozing head. plus uh, six. Oh, yeah, that totally hits. Ooh. So do your damage. One to twelve. Uh, six plus plus five plus plus eleven, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Cool. And you move it ten feet away. So it hits the wall. Kaboom! Whack! Fourteen points. Damn. Fourteen points, and that thing hits the wall. Uh, is now no longer next to your buddy. Yeah. All right. And cool. Is that? Is that I your got you. Move? Nisha is impressed. Nice. All right. Next up. To remember, you're hasted. You get another action. Plus, you have double your normal movement, so you can actually oh, move. I can, I can attack again. You can, yeah, you can attack you can again. And I can move and attack. Since he got knocked away, you can charge him again. Do it. Oh yeah. Do I'm it. gonna finish him. Finish the crazy this evil. This guy's really big. He's like twice as big as those ones on the bottom. So like four Same. times as big as well, me. Remember, yeah. you still have two more attacks. Two this more one, attacks. Because you get two attacks only, plus a haste gives you another two more attacks. Okay, one. so here's the thing with a one. Roll damage, no. and I'll tell you why you hit yourself. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh! oh. oh. Actually, actually, he's a halfling. He rolls, he rolls he over. He does get to roll, roll ones over. Oh, he has there you go. To roll. I am a halfling. There you go, re-roll. <laughs> Are you the one only one here that doesn't suffer from Next. 12? Am I, am the one. Am the one. <laughs> 12. That's why this is collaborative game, because I'll kill you all. <laughs> <laughs> so 12 plus, uh, right? Yep, plus, plus 6. Plus 6 to hit is it 18. 18? Ooh, so. yeah. Totally hit. So then uh, damage on him. 5 plus, plus 6. No. Yeah, plus 6 plus 5. So plus 11. That 11. plus 11. So okay. 11. What's the number? What is your final answer? 16. I'm bad with math. 16. <laughs> Six, yes. That is your <laughs> That's your first attack action. You now can do another attack action. Oh, attack oh, again. <laughs> so roll because two I love this guy. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I said you guys next to each other. Roll 2d20s. Come on. Roll, roll, two roll two d20s. d20s. Four. <laughs> 14. Okay. Um, Which one the, so the second one definitely hits. The He's first one definitely hits. Uh, yeah. yeah, they both hit, so go ahead and roll your damage. Hello again. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, me, I'm still you here. You only get plus six because you didn't charge him this time. So. Yes, I'm not going away, I'm still here. Ooh, it says Gary Flip That's it over. 12. That's a 12. Yes! Yeah. Yeah. All right, Max. 12 plus, plus six. six. 12 plus six, 18. and another roll one more time. 
This one? Yes. <laughs> So plus another 11. All Jeez. right, so we have 59 oh. hit points. What? This guy is not down. He's, He's not up. down or not down? He is not, not down. Not uh, down. Yeah, but that was but quite you an introduction. Are turning no. him into sushi. <laughs> no. He's definitely cut up. You can take a bonus action this turn to do an action surge to get another two attacks. I will do that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're not finished yet. <laughs> Five. Uh, that's that's uh, five, 12. Totally 12. hits. Oh. Now roll again. I'm still here. <laughs> Two points plus... Uh, five more. Three, no, sorry, plus six more. So that's eight, and you get another attack. Eight. All right. Wow. wow, this is incredible. I'm like a superhuman <laughs> halfling This is what you do when you do it well. Destruction. <laughs> Charmone, the destroyer. Ooh. 19. Uh, yeah, that's totally 20. hits. Yeah. Nine oh. points. Six, Damn. so 15. Oh my god. He's got it. Okay. <laughs> this guy. You have you definitely can tell that he can barely stand. Barely. Oh, feel you weak. Have severed major ligaments and he is just <laughs> um, however, he's still standing. Barely. I'm talking like, like barely. <laughs> um, and that was magnificent. That was a very magnificent. Yes. Take the poison damage. Ooh, I like fifth edition. Welcome. To <laughs> <laughs> okay. Next up. Next up is Papa Pow. Papa Pow. Wow. Are you getting? Are you somebody eating you right now? No. You were, you're okay? Yeah, I'm it's fine. the other guy that's okay. The, 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 the friend. Okay. The friend yeah, his top. mentor. The, the Shadowfell. The Shadowfell singer. Shadowfell. 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 All right. Well, I like being up on this perch, hmm. as I am a feline. And I can probably... So, when I the other guy that I had marked, because he vanished, my mark vanished with him. It doesn't transfer. Oh, over. You can replace real? it with a bonus yeah. action. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Then we'll mark the guy up there who's... You go... Hey you! I ring a little bell. Ding, 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 ding. Look over here at me! At me! A cute little bow on your forehead. Oh, no. Just ding, ding. Right. Uh, that is uh, twenty. Hits. Okay. These Four. guys are thirteen massive. Damage. They have muscles on top of muscles. Oh yeah. Thirteen points muscle. of damage. All right. Um, is that your final answer? <coughs> yeah. Okay, next up. And then we wrap right around back up to the top to Lady uh, White. No, that's Oh, fine. wait. No, sorry. You didn't go yet? Did you go? Oh, I'm well, where he goes on now. I'm sorry. You and then the also the lower needs to All right, that's okay. Lower lower three. Three. So yeah, she shot this three. guy. Did he stop eating him? No. Nope. He's still eating him. Very hungry. Didn't even bunch. No? Okay, so um, I no. am going to... Yeah. Um, Still attempt to punch the gentleman in front of me. Um, as my hands continue to light up, and I will attack him and hit an armor class of 16. Yep. Mm. He is going to take um, seven points of magical bludgeoning damage. Yes. As I mm. plow into him, and then I will spend a key point to flurry of blows and attack him two more times. Yes, oh. please. I will hit armor class. 19 yep. and 21. Yep. And he is going to take seven, seven, 14 more points of magical bludgeoning damage. And using my technique of the drunken master, I am ah. able to immediately disengage from him with no action expenditure whatsoever. And so Ooh. I move from him with no opportunity attacks because I, I am disengaging from anybody. Oh. And I race up the stairs, <laughs> hit here, jump from here, oh. land here with my 90 movement speed right now, yeah. and uh, and I, I will use my extra action to go ahead and hit this guy who's trying to eat my mentor, Mac, who is a total, total right? lady, mm -hmm. ladies so as guy. you leave... I'm going to roll a one, but I'm going to use my inspiration that Good you job. gave me earlier. Oh, and so I'm as you leave, that. Yeah. that one is astounded, <laughs> and he is the guy, oh. lower guy. This guy? Yeah, he's out. Wow. And he is down. Down and out. And uh, on my inspiration, instead, I hit armor class 26 
Um, and he, guy, guy trying to eat my master, my, uh, my mentor, is going to take six points of magical bludgeoning damage as Woo. I get right up in his grill, and he will not be eating any more by fists. Yes. <laughs> you still have your uh, haste extra action. That was my haste extra action. Oh, so yeah. go ahead wow. and roll me a. We're small, but we do damage. Acrobatics. Acrobatics check. You got it. I happen to be trained in acrobatics. Because you're a monk. This is because um, you're a monk. Twelve. Uh, you manage to, when you punch him, because you're like, don't eat him, you punch him and you, and separate. So mm. now he's got your friend in his mouth, but he's not connected to him. Nice. So, ah, yeah, you're also going to get a high five as he flip past. I was really focused. It's close. the lower guys. So those two are going to let go of the nobles that are coming after you. Mm-hmm. And they're going to hit for, or we're going to try to hit. Yeah, they're going for damage. They're going to attempt to. And one's going to miss, but the one in front of you is a, well, that might miss too, a 14. 16. They both hit you, and they're as like, No, no, no. You think, see. They just make noises. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. But right. it's like in your face. It's just Instinct. like when you so they have bad breath. They have bad breath. It's just like when you're crowd surfing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, so they do that. Who else is down there? Are any of our friends down? The closest would be over at the door. Okay, nope, they won't go there, so we're top of the round. Top of the round comes back to Flaming White House. All right, so I, might, I can't see over here. Are those just stairs to go up? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to try to make my way up through mm-hmm. there. To this dude. Okay. Push. Okay. Oh. You can make him pay. Make and him I'm going to poison spray him. Okay. Poison. Poison. That is a nine. Poison. Right. Poison. So let's see. <laughs> let's see. How, where's my other D? There we go. Aw, oh, man. It's only five points. Okay. Of every penny counts. Counts. Okay. So next we have. Yeah. Um. Since they're swarming on this one, uh, I'm. Don't worry about that guy. I have to. Yeah, I got. I looked over. Well, that's a bloody mess. Uh, I'm going to uh, step back and back to the stairs. Right yep. To there. Yep. And just uh, firebolt the one that's standing up there. This one. Uh-huh. Firebolt. Uh, for a. Where's my buttons? There it is. Uh, for a uh, 15 to hit. Hits. Hits. For. Uh, 16 points. 16 nice. points nice. Cool. nice. Okay. And I uh, will. That guy's down. All right. So next we have Ziggy. Okay. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is stab the one I've been stabbing. Uh, that would be a 25. Mm-hmm. Okay. 25. Uh-huh, uh, totally hits. For nine points of damage. Mm. Yeah. Nine points of damage. I think that one is. Nope, not down. But yeah, but you got him. Okay, and then with my bonus action, I look back at our manager and I go, "I need some help over here." And I give her some bard and bard against me. Wow. You can add a D8. A D8? Wow. Yeah. my attacks? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Whatever. One roll. Cool. One, roll. one roll. You get bard against me. Wow. You, you can I like wait. bard against me. I can wait to use it. To decide whether you use it or not. Okay. I'm inspired. I'm yeah. Yeah. Remember, you have inspiration wow. for the items you want. I think I'm too. inspired in real life. Okay, so the guy that Shaman has been beating up, yes. he tries to push past you. Uh, eh. So he walks in between. He doesn't leave your um, he's not a doesn't leave being adjacent to you. He kind of walks around you and grabs the uh, Oh no. 
the dude. Nisha? Nisha? Yes. No, 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 grabs him. no, no. Uh, and then walks back. No. <sighs> Into the portal? Yeah. You can swing at him. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. No, no, ah, 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 ah. Jeez. Two. The half thing's one. What's your bonus? <laughs> the six? Three. Plus six, nine. Well, you no, hit him. six, seven, eight, plus one. So Very low, nine. Casey. I do hit. I nine. do hit. <laughs> I hit. Uh, uh, what seven points. Seven. So this is what you see. He's very limping in that like really weird, like gross kind of way, and he grabs this guy, and he throws the shadow fell into the portal, and. Uh, as you hit him, you notice that like he dies like immediately. Like, he barely had any hit points left, and he goes to reach into the portal, and it closes and it cuts off his hand, and he's lying on the ground, dead. The, the creature. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. So uh-huh. the Shadowfell is through the portal, and he's there. So we have. Let's see. Oh. Yes. Okay, so... Oh. So th- is that one gone? Yeah. Yeah, so that guy's gone. Now the other guy on this side, he is still... Oh, so Nisha's gone? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Nisha's gone. Oh. Nisha's gone. Oh. You did everything you could. You did everything oh. you could. Now, the guys on this side, uh, he goes in and he's he starts gnawing on uh, the Shadowfell. Your, is that you? Mm-hmm. Is that your mentor? No. Is that Mine. your mentor? Mine. Yeah, so he's gnawing on him, and he's trying to drag him back. Make me a perception check. Twelve. Uh, what was your guy's name? Uh, uh, Mac. Mac's dead. <gasps> oh. And he's crawling backwards into the portal. And he's pulling uh, the dead body with him. Uh, and he's like eating him while he's doing it. Eating him. And he makes it into the portal and he's pulling uh, and he's pulling the your friend. Would you like to make an attempt to grab your friend? I do. Okay. I do want to make an attempt to grab him. Alright. Just uh, strength. I'm really good at strength checks. <laughs> you got inspiration, right? Natural 20 gives me a 19. You have. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh. By that, you have the opposite. Um, you, he's pulling him back, and you grab him, and you're doing this tug of war with your friend. Yeah. And he's got his fingers inside of your friend, and he just tears a piece off uh. as he goes back in to the portal, and the portal oh. closes. But Mac is still here. Mac is Minus there. the piece the guy took. Minus the shoulder in his mouth and uh, part of his chest that he ripped out as he was going through the portal. And now all the portals are closed, and there are zombies down in that lower area. Still zombies. Still zombies. Zombie. Yes. Zombie. Now the upper Zombie. part is gone. Can there. we not book any no more, more gigs here? I this is a bad on. place. Shimon, Shimon. We need the money. It this is your is turn. There place. are zombies left here I to don't kill. Like this venue. But this is where everybody <laughs> got their start. <laughs> so, uh, Never who's playing left? here again. There's, there Never <laughs> this venue <That's> sucks. <laughs> <laughs> this is all. Everything is like there's these creatures here. Mm-hmm. Right. So can I? Run! I'm really angry oh, I'm because I lost my only Turn friend. Oh my god. <laughs> Turn around! And I'm red in the face and I'm like, no! And I... Can we give him more d20s? Just roll four d20s. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh. You have four attacks, so... I, I run! And I... <coughs> I leap off the balcony! Acrobatics! At this person. Yeah, go ahead and roll acrobatics right. while you're doing that. How do I do that? Roll so roll a d20. Nine. Plus. 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 Six. Whoa, you're... you're yeah, I made mean, you strong. <laughs> I do a somersault. <laughs> totally <laughs> land it. How do you want to land? 
I'm gonna land with my great axe buried in the head. <laughs> All right. This, whatever okay, that is. Roll to attack. Nineteen. Ooh, Absolutely. Yes. And flip. you have a bonus of six to just damage, right? No. Six. So it's twelve. Twelve. Okay. You you've been whittling away at this guy, and he was looking pretty pretty close to death anyway. All of a sudden, your halfling comes in with his base, his axe, and. <laughs> Back right in the head, splits it all the way down to here, and the whole thing kind of unfolds. And he's got this like grotesque look on its face, and the, the zombie next to it actually goes, "Huh?" Oh. <laughs> you have three more attacks. You can attack the one next to it. You're next. All right. So go ahead and roll three d twenty. Three D twenty. What you got in here? Whoa. Nineteen, ten, and four. Um well so four, four plus is four plus four is probably yeah. ten um, plus. Those all 10. hit. Oh wow. All wow. of them hit. All even yes. four. Wow. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> you couldn't get a charge. Nobody better mess with me. Three one, yeah. two, one, three, but, you know, there's right. a lot more coming. <laughs> Math man, 20? 20 points of damage. You had already done three points of damage to it, and what does this look like as you kill this guy? What does it look like? I bury my axe in the chest, and then just keep slicing down. Uh, just and like this, but backwards. Sorry, 25. Exactly. And then, and, then, and then they cut open, I reach in and I grab the whatever, is there a heart in there? There's hearts, guts, all sorts Pull of it out. Arr, take a bite out of it and oh. spit it out right <laughs> into the face of the creature. Pull me a constitution saving throw. Yeah. <laughs> oh. It is rotten people. Not a good idea, is it? Or... <laughs> you are caught in the moment. Max! Natural, natural, 20. 20. Natural, 20. natural 20. You are so lucky. You you taste the putrescence. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Spicy. The <laughs> ickier. <Yeah. laughs> awesome. Thank you very much. Amore. I will turn and, like the flash, I continue moving super speed down the stairs right to this guy right here. And uh, I will unload on his face in pure raw anger uh, at the death of my mentor. So, uh, first attack uh, hits a meager armor class 11. Uh, totally hits. You're, ace the, you're looking for an 8 through zombies. He will take um, 6 points of magical bludgeoning damage, and then I will spend a key point and I will flurry of blows on him. Cool. Hitting armor class 15 and 19. Yes. And he will take another seven, uh, six, 13 points of magical bludgeoning damage. So 13 20. and uh, six to begin with is 19 points of damage. Oh, so close. So, and then I take my extra attack from being hasted. Thank you. Uh, and uh, do a spinning kick right up to his face. Armor class 21 for another. Um, Eight points of bludgeoning magical damage. And he's dead. So what is what did you just do? You just pummel him and do basically a Basically just a, a series of flurry of blows so Dedicate. fast, like all <laughs> limbs all at once, like a little Tasmanian devil. <laughs> um, because I still have movement left, you I, bag his head? I move straight to here, and I get right in this guy's face, and I'm like, stop! Hammer time. <laughs> is this guy dead too? Wasn't this the guy that you spit yes. his heart out yeah. in his face? I, okay. am, I, almost, I almost zombied we myself in that guy. Jesus. Papa Pa is still super yes. inspired and yes. says, Ziggy, what do you want me to do? Shoot those guys! <laughs> These guys? Um, sure Shot is so buoyed by Ziggy's inspiration that she jumps off and then runs up. To this guy, and it's gonna mm. use her sh short sword. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Pa -pa! Pa -pa! Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Uh, Roll it. No, did I skip you? Oh, 11? Uh, no, no, no. 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 She's okay. first. Yeah. You just a really lot, a lot yeah. of attacks. <laughs> 11? Yes. Oh, good. 
Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, my short sword. Yeah. Poof, poof, I have to roll. Two. Nice. Okay. And that is a 14. It's really hard not to hit these okay, zombies. Good. And the, oh, it's these are no. sixes. Because they're zombies. Because they're zombies. Brains. Uh, 11. Brain, more brains. Um, 10 and 9. 19. Okay. Two hit? Yes. Yeah. Oh, so that was the. Oh, that was, that was damage. damage. All of, on one guy. Yeah. D dead. <laughs> <laughs> you, you oh, I didn't even do my D eight. I didn't you even didn't do need, my. You I don't need. You need, you need, need right. Yeah. Okay, so you killed it with your sword. Actually, can I just pretend he's like a little bit alive, and I just kind of toy with him a little? So what <laughs> happens? <laughs> so what happens is uh, you guys see her. She goes up and and then. Kind of like a mouse, like pushes it over and then hops on top of it mm -hmm. and then kind of like kicks it with her feet. <laughs> 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 Funny kicker. Okay, so there's one more, right? Is that yep, there's it? one yeah. left right in front of Blade Saw. <laughs> <laughs> Blade Saw! <laughs> All right. Ah, 18 to hit. An 18 will hit me. Okay. It only fuels my fury. Um, so he goes to smack you. For two points of damage. <laughs> and right at the top of the round, that's Nora. My mom used to spank me harder than that. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a good childhood. I look over, <laughs> and I look over, it's like, hey, that's Amore. Uh, and uh, <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and, uh, and uh, the dude, the, the zombie that's that was at that attacked him, I eldritch blast him from there. From, nice. from where he's yes. Beep, beep. That is an 18 to hit. Yeah. And da 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 da. Ten points of damage. Beautiful. Nice. Beep, beep, beep. You see this glow? What color is it? Ah, uh, it's red. This bright red streaking. And then. And it and leaves go. red. That's what you get. That's what you get. <laughs> Kyle. Firebolt towards the last remaining zombie. For uh, 12 to hit. Yep. For 13 points. 13 points nice. of damage does it. Nice. And the whole thing. And it smells like the worst barbecue you've ever Ooh. been to. Ooh. <laughs> but now you've killed all the zombies. There are dead nobles. Ugh. In here, uh, there's dead zombies. The place is littered in decay and ichor and guts. I'll go check to see who's still okay and go check the bodies and pick up any jewelry that's not. <laughs> Noble jewelry. Are oh, you looking for jewelry? Yeah, man, go for it. Go ahead, roll man. Uh, <laughs> roll um, uh, investigation. Investigation? Yeah. Uh, and roll me perception, Nora. 16 right. on the investigation. Yep, you got like seven rings. Wow. Some earrings. Oh, That's an eight. Nope, dead. Nope, dead. <laughs> oh, nope, can dead. I roll I'm going to use my inspiration to re-roll that. Okay. Can I do that? Yeah. No, that's worse. Cool. <laughs> you look back. Where did he go? Where did he go? Where did that guy go? The priest? The, where did the priest go? Really? Oh, man. We ain't going to get paid for this. Do we have anybody who can this track guy? him? That guy? He took off? Yeah, when wow. they eat the people who pay you, it's bad. Yeah. Well, you got, got rings. Where's it? Wait, they, they split without paying us for our gig? Well, some of them were. Well, he was. Did we get a deposit? He was trying to go through that uh, door. Did he go through that door? Did anybody see where he went? I was shooting stuff. He was at that door the last time I saw him. Maybe he's in there. Yeah. Bad gig. Uh, I'm gonna go check the door. Is it locked? Nope. Okay. You mean this door? Do you look yeah. inside? The two yeah, of you yeah. look inside, <laughs> and he's got a bag. He's just packing his bag. He's got clothes. He's got oh. some books, and he goes. No. <laughs> I don't mean to interrupt because it looks like you're kind of busy, but we feel like we need to have a little chat out here. Also, we're still getting paid, right? Yeah. <laughs> How much are we gonna pay you? Uh, how much was it? Was it like 3,000 yeah, platinum? Yeah, it was. I don't think so. Is that? Oh, come on. Um, okay. Just come on in. Okay. And what you guys see in front of you is actually a great 
like it's a pretty fantastic library. There's like a little fireplace. There's like floor to ceiling bookshelves. You could sell all of these books and get the money. This is um, cozy. He's got a, a desk. He has another table, like a dining table, that but it's like packed with papers and books. There's a couple chairs, some pillows. Yeah, I don't read anyways. I'm a. <laughs> Well, I'm looking around the room. I'm gonna walk up to to you, Ziggy, and like hand you some rings. Oh, I got us covered for the deposit. I'm gonna put them in my pouch. <laughs> <laughs> so he he kind of and he walks back to his desk and he puts the bag down and he sits in his. So you made a deal with some bad demon guys that... Yes, I didn't make a deal. Oh? No? I didn't make it. Why would you... Because you said something bad was done, and now you had to pay the price. I didn't say that. You wouldn't have heard that. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, that's not what, But I say, that's not what you said earlier. What did I, what did I say? And I relay what he what, said. What did, you, what, is <laughs> <laughs> what did he say? Uh, it was a mistake. Um... Trying to remember now. Too. Yeah, no worries. So, um, roll a history check. Okay. Uh, that is a six. <laughs> okay. So, um, he sits, he's like. I'll try to persuade him. So, why don't you tell us what really, really happened here? I would like to assist him. All right, you have advantage. Uh, roll natural 20 of on the first one. Of course you did, Kyle. Ooh. And just so everyone knows. Kyle's a hard time rolling under a 15, so. Uh, with my persuasion, it's uh, 27. <laughs> so why don't you tell us what's really going on? <laughs> okay, fine. Obviously, I'm not a little old man. I'm just as old as, well, they're older. But we, Shadowfell and I have been traveling for a really long time. And we just kind of got, we were adventurers together. And, you know, we've, we've done a lot of really great things. Um, I learned that over time I just got tired of killing things and adventuring. And I just, uh... I wanted to do something better. So we came up with a plan. You know, they, they travel, they kind of spread the word, and then we do charity events, and it's kind of like a money maker, but also we actually do help kids. Um, but yeah, there was, this, there was this guy that we used to play with, and we, there was this big, there was this big demon situation, and uh, there was this, it was a staff of power, and one of our friends just kind of got lost in it, and he, like, he kind of kept wanting to go back for the staff of power, and uh, there was this great battle, and we kind of left him behind. And we thought that he was dead, because there's no way you could survive that, but... What kind of people leaves their bandmate behind to die? <laughs> <laughs> mm. Yeah. Yeah. So that is um, those are the consequences when you leave someone behind and you don't make sure they're okay. Wait, those are the consequences? Oh, <laughs> uh, guys. Never leave anyone behind I mean, or a demon will attack. Asking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so um, it's. Um, well, I think that's, well, deplorable. That, that's understandable. I mean, we understand. It's. You make these mistakes, and yeah, but now we, we have to forgive. go. Now we gotta go find, and we gotta find them. And Next day. I gotta like I Just don't know it. what that symbol was, and what? Um, the red skull. Yeah, hmm. I gotta I gotta figure it out. I don't, actually don't know much. Anything about in religion. these books? Yeah. Did you say you can? Well, I think I have something. I have, I've been collecting books for a really long time, so I don't know if can you guys I wanted to. Magic in the room. Oh, there's lots of weird magic all over the place. Yeah. Did you uh, say but no nothing that jumps out? Nothing that jumps out. Mm -mm. But um, hmm. yeah. So I need to. Uh, I, I think there's some books in here. And he walks up to one of the shelves and he starts pulling some books down. It's like, yeah, if you guys can help, I mean. We gotta figure a way to get them back. Th I'm sorry, I didn't mean to be so rude out there. I just really wanted to get in here so I could figure things out. And then I panicked and started packing. But that's, you know, like, there's just a lot going on in my mind. There's a lot. It's like, this situation is big. It was, was a long time ago. It was like 10 years ago. Are you really a priest of Lathander? 
Well, now, yeah. So could you heal or bring some kind of help to the people who've been killed or anything like that? Uh, I, I know people are better at it than, than myself, yeah. but also that costs a lot of money to bring people back. There's a lot of money out there on the floor right now. <laughs> yeah, oh. Why, did you give I'm sure, uh, what? I'm sure that we could use their items to bring them back, because I'm sure they'd be more than willing to spend what they had on them to bring them back to life. Well, I can connect with their families. Oh, that's, okay. that's pretty easy. Hey, man, that's a downed payment. It is totally yeah. downed. Yeah. Down payment. Uh, yeah, so I don't know if any of you can read. And yeah. if you want to help me try yes. to figure out. You read. Sure. Yeah. Read. What, what language do you read? <laughs> cool. We're going to pause right there because we're going into a montage. 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 <laughs> what we're going to do is try to figure out. What do you want to figure out? What do you guys want to know? Tell me what, what you that want. Skull what that is? skull symbol means. What the skull symbol means. Um, who are, like, do we know anything about the, the portal situation? In Portals. This? Yeah. Uh, do we know anything about the beings that that appeared? Okay. So. Anybody hurt? Anybody need healing? I don't think you guys. Did you guys even get yeah, hit? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's a scratch. Yeah, it's just a scratch. <laughs> it's I just a flesh Seven wound. points of damage. Seven. Oh, seven? Yeah. I have a potion. What? I have a healing potion. Drink this! Oh, wait, I got a healing potion. I'll drink my healing potion. Yeah. Alright, so we're going into a montage. Who is going to stay and look for books? About so you two wanted to learn so, about the skulls, right? Yeah, I uh, have exactly. a one of my warlock big traits is I can comprehend any written language. Ooh. So I, I scroll through everything. All right, so you're looking for stuff. What are the rest of you doing, Jason? Um, I was going to say I could have healed you with my spell, but it's okay. I got it. I'll get you next time. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm in, definitely interested in, in looking through the books to just. For the general knowledge. I feel like when we determine what that skull is, <coughs> that will explain a lot of other things that we need to look for. The path. Cool. So we'll find what the skull is. The skull's the key. All right. Um, the, so the three of you are going to look for the skull information. Do you? What are you guys looking for? The portals or? Oh uh, yeah. I can actually detect portals, like the closest portal within a mile. Like just, I can just do that. Wow. What is that? Ranger. I think it's, yeah. The, the Horizon Walker. The Horizon Walker. Oh, man. Oh. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, yeah, my God. The, Are you the serious? Portal. Yeah. Cool. That actually is pretty amazing. Well, if you want to, you want to, if you want to go with this manager, that's what she's, she found a way I mean, to I get it. I don't always get the security deposit, but I can detect portals. It's okay. I think we got the money covered. This is how we yeah. save on transportation when we get uh, Yep, uh, yep. Cool. Okay, so what are you guys doing then? Uh, she's gonna be doing that for the portal. I'll throw in for them on the. Uh, this are we? Skull are we in there? You're inside of there. In Can there. we open it? Is there stuff? Is under there it? stuff under there? Oh, I don't know. Lift it up. Lift it up. Let's see. Let's see. I have no idea. Oh. Well, there's a room. There's, there's walls. <laughs> it's a room. Oh, oh there's trap doors. Oh, there's a trap door. Oh. oh Three cool. trap doors. Well, pretend those are bookshelves and fireplaces. <laughs> <laughs> Your imagination. Okay, cool. So, everyone who's looking for portals, go ahead and roll. Um, whatever you are proficient in, whether it is history, arcana, investigation, perception. And for us looking at the skull stuff? Uh, I'm sorry, all, uh, I meant the skull stuff. Oh, oh. Skull okay. stuff first. Damn. I think I just sense it. Cool. I'm going to hold there. Okay. Eight. 21. Cool. 21. Wow. Mm -hmm. Are you looking for portals? Or are you looking well, for. Um, did you get I actually, what? I'm not looking. I'm just looking for the books. No, we're looking oh, for the books. Oh, we are looking. You want to go over there? Just those with three of us looking for okay. the books. Okay. Oh, what are we? What are we rolling? Everybody's in that room. I'm just gonna go. Invest. Check out. All right. So whatever you're proficient in, history, arcana, investigation, perception. Okay. So that is a thirteen. Okay. So um, anyone else looking for the skulls? We got one, two, three. All right. So you are, you kind of, you find a couple books, but the two of you find a 
bunch of books. It has a big red skull on the cover. <laughs> written by the red you skull You actually, guy. you find a pamphlet that says, um, pamphlet. Uh, Our Lord and Savior, Ball. Uh, the Lord of Murder. Ball. Ball. I don't want to play ball with these guys. No. Oh. And it says, uh, <laughs> the cult people die for. <laughs> and it's true. Yes. Evil is a four-letter word. Yeah, it really is. <laughs> um, so, you guys find this. It is the Lord of Murder, and you deduce by reading all the things that um, this person up there is a white, and he is creating an army of zombies. That is what you know now about that. That dude that was up there. Yeah. The big, super big guy. Mm -hmm. uh, portals. You sense a portal. You, it, you sense it up and that way. But you're inside, right? So you're, you're yeah. Okay. And you go to this other room, and it looks like a little um, prayer room. There's holy water. Oh, I, I take the holy water. You fill up some flasks? Yes. Cool. Do I have flasks? You empty the flasks of their booze and wine. You go. Oh, oh, man. Okay, okay. Why would you, you do? do that? Why would you do that? <laughs> <laughs> so you have two I flasks. I have a water skin. Cool. I water skin. I empty that out and I put holy water in it. Cool. There you go. You have uh, a wine skin of holy water. Wow. Yeah. Holy All right, water. what are you doing, Chris? <laughs> yes. Taking my makeup. You're just brushing the my bathroom. beard out. <laughs> yeah. I don't do brushing. this book thing. <laughs> uh, <laughs> do this go, book. Go, go search for stuff. Maybe. Uh, I feel like you're sad. Find a thing? I can go look around, I guess. I'm not very good at it. It's okay. You don't have to force anyone to do anything. So, room. you Keep have a white sure skin. You okay. guys have yeah. some information. He is looking through books, and he's just like, I can't believe we left him. I can't believe we left him. Um, so, who, what was the name of your friend you left? Dwight. Dwight? Dwight. Thanks, Dwight. 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 Vipka name. That's scary. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it seems Dwight. Dwight the White? And now he's, he's a white. <laughs> yes, that's true. It's just not... I know, it's kind of, <laughs> who would have thought? <laughs> and he's but. making an army of zombies. But what's his goal? Um, he's to bringing the band back here. Yeah. I don't know, I he's, he looks like, I, I mean, he probably has that staff of power, so. Um, mm. Yeah, I don't know what he wants. Probably you know, revenge, because we totally, totally messed him up. We totally, well, oh, that's bad. Huh. Yeah. It sounds familiar. I don't know what you're talking about. But, um, you know, they're still alive, I'm sure. I mean, he was trying to punish, so he's probably trying to they're punish They're all also alive. alive. No. That's what I was asking if you uh, want to help out your old buddy. What? Was it Maros? Mac. Mac. Mac is dead. He bolts. He goes, why didn't you say something earlier? And he jumps up and runs up, and he picks him up, and he carries him off into one of the other chambers uh, in uh, this side. And he lays him on a table, and he starts putting stuff on him, and and, and that's the only person up there. That no was the only of the ones who didn't. Like, oh man, this is bad. This is bad. We have to save those guys. We have to save them. We have to save them. They're good. They do so much for people. We like them. You can just go loot all the nobles. Um, what do you want? What, what do you want? Would you please? What can we do? You got any? Well, if we're gonna go fight he these white guys, he starts taking off his rings. <laughs> you got any like things to fight undead? Yes, <laughs> I have holy water. Yeah, we've that's got good. holy water. Holy water. We have holy, holy water. water. We should all fill up our flasks. Then. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Yeah, idea. I can so grab a couple holy. more wineskins. Okay. okay. Um, Including the nobles, I like that. The money. Yeah. We need the money. Do we have barrels? Okay, I'll go out and start like turning, flipping the nobles for. I gotta figure out room. where it is, though. I gotta figure out where. Hey, figure out where uh, they would take them. Uh, pop, pop, pop. Yeah. Did you figure out where those? You, you're good at finding stuff. Did oh, you I find found a portal. Where they go? Oh, where? Where's the yeah. portal? Oh, it's just up that way. Oh, oh, that's that's the Great Mountain. Oh. Um, I wonder. And he runs back into this other room. And he picks up some books and he flips through. It's like, 
there's an ancient temple up there, but I didn't know what it was for, and now it all makes sense. The betting is for be ball. Oh, it's wow. probably for ball. Yeah. It's and it's it's not that long. It'd probably take a few hours to get and up his there. his white servant. Man. White hand man, actually. My husband. <laughs> Uh, and um, I, hear I can long. I can give you some healing potions, and um, great. yeah, we'll take yeah, them. yeah. I, so you're I, not. I coming? wish I was better. You're not at coming. This. You're not coming. Right? I need, you're coming, right? I'm not coming. I need to make sure that I preserve my friends so I can figure out how to bring them back. Yeah. Salt. Wait, how did he die? And he runs back over. Mm -hmm. and you guys all follow him. Yeah, oh, you know, by one of the oh zombie God. things. Is he going to turn into one of them? Yes. Death by chewing. Okay. Oh. So if you, if you hit the brain, they don't come back, right? Wait, wait, no. But no, we, we oh. want to save them. They, they'll they probably be bigger once they're all back together. Um, so let's do that. Okay, so you guys go find him. I'm going to stay here, fix him. And what, Which one was this? Mac. Mac. Oh, Mac. Oh, buddy, you were my favorite. So just... Just to be clear, if we find them, we're not allowed to kill them? Don't kill them. What if they're already dead and they're monster type? You oh. know, like, do we kill them then and then bring I, them back? This is a lot to think about. I'm not prepared. I'm not actually good at we'll this. We'll figure it out when we get there. I'm, I'm just here to reap the rewards and, and raise money for kids, so mm -hmm. I should have paid more attention in seminary school. You guys think I'm a bad manager? <laughs> you guys think I'm a bad manager? I take back right? everything I've said. You're much better than that. Was a, that was a lot of stuff he said about you. He said a lot. I take back everything. You take it. So you were, uh, you were just reading stuff as well, right? Yeah. Go ahead and roll me. Um, investigation. Or, what, what are you proficient in? Uh, let's see. Investigation. investigation. Yeah. Go ahead and, and roll that. Okay. Let's see if you can find anything on what's. Ten. Can't seem to find anything on whites. Yeah. But now you have a quest. You have to go retrieve your mentors. And that is where we're going to go to break. Break. Thank you guys for allowing us to break. Earthbreaker Goon from Twitter brought us cupcakes that Satine can have. He figured a way to make frosting with this family that is no sugar, no dairy, and oh my god, it was so good. So sorry it took us so long to get back. But I was eating the deliciousness. But here we are, back again. And the band is here, all in one piece. And you have found out that the Shadowfell, your mentors, have been taken. One has been killed. Sorry, Chris. And yeah, so you guys found that there's a portal on a mountaintop nearby. It is about... A lot of time had, had passed going through that montage. So it's about 2 a.m. Wow. Um, however, in that montage, which the, uh, the old priest, who is actually not an old priest, it was all in act, used to have a bunch of rings, now they're in somebody's pocket. Um, he explains that whites, after doing all his research, um, sunlight is their weakness. Ah. Yes. Mm. So. Attacking at night is bad. Attacking at night is bad. How good. long will it take? The light is the weakness. The light is a weakness. I think so we want to do it when the light's out. Attacking at night is bad. Weak. Yeah. <laughs> Attacking at night is bad. Mm. So, it's about 2 a.m. However, they just ate your friend. So, whatever you guys want to do, what is the plan? How We're still far, here. Right? How far away is the portal? It is. I would say it's like a four or five hour hike up the mountain. And by the time we hike there, we'll be dawn. Dawnish. No. Uh, we took enough rest yeah, here, I guess. Is everybody feeling rested? And attacking in the yeah, day. Yeah, short rest. Okay. Yeah, we're short rest. Okay. I think we might right. soldier on. Just, just, All right. Yeah. Um, oh. He had given you four healing potions. Wow. Yes, and an extra wine skin of holy oh. water. Okay. So, my dear friends, I, 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 I can, can I take a healing potion? Sure. You a, who has I a healing potion? I have a scratch. I have a, oh, oh, we do a hit, hit points on the rest? Yeah. 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 All right. You How many do we get? Roll your dice. So, so you who's holding many? the healing potions? So, just roll one ten. The one? Roll I'll, I'll, I'll hold one. Wow. Disperse yeah. them. I'll hold one. I don't actually have one. I'll, I don't mind. You want one? I'll hold one. Okay, so we have one here. Kyle has one. Who else has one? 
I have already. I have a bunch Sounds of like we're going okay, into some oh, danger. Might as well okay. heal now. All right, guys. It is nighttime. <coughs> the mountaintop. It's a, you know it's it's oceanside, but the mountaintop is inland, and the moon shining bright lights up the, the side of the mountain, and you do see that it's a little bit snowy at the top of that mountain. Yeah. You ready to embark? Um, no snakes on the way, I take it. Since it's. I, I like I like taking you know, it gets snakes as I go. Colder, the farther snakes up you go. Animal snakes. friendship's one of my innate abilities. Okay, snakes. all right. It's well, we'll see if there are on their way. It's only snakes. Okay. Okay. So, what's the plan? Did you study law? Ah, mm-hmm. uh, the plan! I don't know. Uh, I'd say we just we go up and figure out how to get in there and attack. Let's we'll venture forth. Just guys. All right. So the plan is walk. Walk. How to walk. Walk. How, <laughs> how, how you can find the way, right, Papa? Pa, pa? Sure can. We follow her. That's the plan. It's her job. Who can anybody get any like sneaking in, looking around things? Sneaking in Sneaking. And things. I can I can cast primeval uh, awareness just yes. to sense if there were yeah? any yes. Ooh, I, I, I can have around. nimbleness. Alright, let's not talk over each other because these mics make things angry. So we have a primeval what is it now? Awareness. Primeval awareness, what does that read that? I can sense whether the following types of creatures are present within one mile. Are we within one mile? Aberrations, celestials, dragons, elementals, fey, fiends, and undead. This feature doesn't reveal the creature's location or number. I just know they're Okay, we will close. definitely come back to that in a very quick moment. Okay. All right, now you two are doing what now? Nothing yet. No. Right I was asking who can sneak in. But, but once we get closer, I can sneak, yes. Okay. okay. I don't wear yeah. armor. Yeah, that'd be good. Okay. That's why I was asking for some snakes, because I figured I could have them go and sneak in and take a look around and come back and let me know. Gotcha. Mm. Uh. They're really good at sneaking. Uh. Yeah, I'm very stealthy. All right. Is there a reptile store in the city <laughs> over at 2 a.m.? We're walking through the woods. I'm pretty sure there's <laughs> animals out there. water deep, so no. No, <laughs> what would you like to do? How sneaky are you? Um, well, I'm a halfling. I'm going to see if there's and, any. Uh, I'm, I'm uh, very still. Are there still any weapons lying around? There, is a, there was a bunch of dead things on the floor. The dead things on the floor were zombies. So they were just kind of... Weapons. Yeah, however, there is a ceremonial dagger. As you're looking for weapons, he says, I'm really sorry. Uh, I came across really strangely earlier, but here's a, a dagger. Just plus one to hit. Okay, time is passing. Mm-hmm. The chances of your friends being alive is. We must go. go. We must go. go. I thought we were walking. All right, so Mm -hmm. you leave this area and you start embarking (coughs) on your journey up the mountain. It is nighttime. It is cold. Everybody can see? Can everybody see? Yeah. I can see. Okay. So, and it's really bright out, too. It's not that bad. I don't know if you've ever been outside in the bright, bright moonlight, full moon and whatnot. You know, those humans, they stumble around in the dark all the time. It's true. So, you're walking and your ranger is, your ranger, right? Papa, Papa. Oh, sorry. Yep. Ranger. Ranger. All right. So you're in the lead. Yes. You're Um, out there. You do your flickering on of your presence. Oh my God. We're surrounded. There's undead all over the base of this mountain. Hmm. It's almost as if there's a really intense battle, and things are just. Everywhere, they're almost in clusters of like 15 to 20 creatures in each cluster, about um, 30 feet away from each other. But even in those clusters, you're still like the clusters are huge, so they're like 10, 15 feet away from each other. So it's massive. This a huge the, battlefield. The base of the mountain. Fire we haven't even gotten out. <laughs> okay. Can I sense like? Movement? Can I sense if they can? You don't see it. You don't feel any movement. Okay. It's very still. So and they're undead. Is, you can sense this from far away. 
they're undead that are up there. They don't. They can stand around forever. They really don't move much. Not until you make them. Mm -hmm. You could do a distraction and maybe make a hole and sneak around. They're not like all holding hands together and like. In a yeah, we could try to sneak mountain. between some of them. Sure. Right. I mean, yeah. So if you could tell us where they are, we can try to go between. I don't know that I can. I think I can just. I don't think I can uh, sense their location exactly, yeah. but I just know that they're around. Yeah. You can sense the area, which is like we'll say it's like a hundred feet up, and it just spreads. It's just all you over. can definitely mm. you can sense the intensity, right? So you can sense the pockets of them, mm. and, just, and it just kind of you know it's all in front of you. So there's like here and here and then over here. So it's kind of like meander through the different pockets of. Okay. So I know uh, the kinds of markings and trailings and things left behind by small woodland mammals. Uh, I was trained as a kid. Uh, so as we're walking along, I'm looking for, for those things using my survival skills to see if there are any small critters in the trees or anything that I might have a brief conversation with. Okay, so go ahead and roll animal handling and, and you too. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll, we'll look for your snakes, we'll look for your squirrels and rabbits. I'm trained in animal handling. Fourteen. Okay. You're looking for animals too? It's a nature? Um, animal handling. Oh, sorry, animal handling. Yeah. Fourteen. Fourteen. Oh, a squirrel comes down. Uh, squeaker, squeakin', squeakum. Squeak, squeak. <laughs> how many, how many, how many rotty things are up there? It's so gross out there. It's like, they're so gross. There's like all these things, and every time we try to get an acorn, they're like, ah, and then we're like, ah, so we just don't even go over there. Do you know how, it's like treasure. There's like a whole dragon's hoard of acorns out there. Is there a way to get past them to get the acorns? Well, we tried to just take them off the trees. What? Yeah, yeah, so like, we just don't go on the ground. Oh, so you can get up past them by going through the trees? Yeah, man, I'm a squirrel. <laughs> <laughs> That's good to know. That's a yeah. pro tip. Yeah, go see these the little dying things right here? I just go, and yeah, he yeah, like, yeah. he goes. Yeah, I can do that. Well, yeah, can. like this, and he runs up the tree. Mm-hmm. And then he's gone. All right, <laughs> I'm like, cool. Um, I turn around and I Can't turn back climb. to the these guys climb. and I go, squeaker, oh wait a minute, different language. <laughs> 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 we can get past the undead by going through the trees. Oh, climb up high? Oh, we're not so we have to climb trees all the way up a mountain? Well, we just, you know, get to the branches that we can cross on. And just, you know, no problem. So you're looking for worry. some snakes. Mm -hmm. What'd you roll? Uh, I got a total of a 17. A little snake. <laughs> and ask him, so do you know where we can get past these dead things? Well, yes, of course. <laughs> Usually I just go underground because I'm a snake and I can kind of do that. There's like a whole, there's like some little rabbit mice dens down there. I like to. Do you see anything big enough for someone my size? That's ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> it is. You're I have to ask. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to come with uh, me for a short trip? I'll bring you back in a day. As long as you're not going where the smelly things are. Animal friendship. Where are we going, buddy? Let's go. Pulls up your leg, and you got this like. Um, That's cheating. Wraps up around your arm. What? <laughs> we can't fit in the holes, anyways. I can speak snake too, buddy. He's size small. I understand. Hey, we're, not, we're not climbing in it, but he's gonna go take a look inside when we get there. I would okay. love to. Mm. All right, what are you doing? Um, is there like a nice little friendly fox or something? Are you looking for a fox? <laughs> yeah. All right. Smart. Roll. What'd you roll? I got a twenty-four. Oh, nice. Wow. Yes. Or any. So you're will do. you're like, how do you call a fox? Is what does there the a song say? about that? What the fox? <laughs> <laughs> how are you trying? 
And, and you look down, and this fox is on his, his back legs, and he's kind of leaned up against you. He's like, that's a really weird sound you're making. What's up, Slylock? What's up? Hey. Yeah. You live around here? I do, actually. I didn't know that. Yeah. 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 What's your name? Uh, Paw Paw Paw. That is a fantastic name. Thanks. Yeah. Um, my name is Ralph. Hey, Ralph. Hey. So, uh, have you lived here long? I have. I've lived here a long time. So yeah. there's lots of uh, dead things around? There are so many dead things. Do they bother you much? They're gross, and they make things smell. And honestly, it's like, I feel like there's this, there's a lot of food up there. Mm -hmm. There's a lot mm -hmm. of food up there, and they're just surviving, and well, it so sucks. My friends and I are trying to get up there. Do you, do you have oh. a way to get up there? You know what the best way? Yeah, you just got to be real quiet. Quiet like a fox. He goes... You guys actually see this fox on his back legs, <laughs> little tiny fox, little orange, got these cute little paws, and nice little nose, and the two of them are just like... Do you want to come? You want to lead us? Not us really. I mean, if, if you snap a twig, then they... <laughs> <laughs> guys, uh, I can make it sound like a big loud noise over there. And then they can make a silence around us? No, no, I can't, no. So. Oh, um, but I can make him over there and then go run over that way. We yeah. can go that way. Sure shot. Just remembered something. You can make it silent, right? Yes. No I know. I can do something else. <laughs> is your, is your is, uncle named Noam Chomsky? Is I'm, am I missing this? Can I pass? Can <laughs> I saying. can I cast pass without trace and then we're just like sorry guys. This is yeah, it gives you like a plus 10, right? No, we're, I think we... It uh, does make you silent, but it does make it almost hard. Yeah, it, it does yes. make it hard to track us. Well, mm -hmm. then, yes. Hey, Fox. Yes. Will you come now? Yes. Okay. Because you're cool. <laughs> you're cool, and I like you. Yeah. Okay. So the two of them start strutting off without talking to you guys, and they're strutting off towards the zombies. Come on, you guys. I follow. All right. Pass all without right. trace. I okay. can understand all of these yeah. conversations. Yeah. I just spec quietly and do not interrupt them. So Hop this is good for an fight. hour. I start talking about snake and draconic. Last an hour. Uh, last an hour. Uh, for the duration, each creature you choose within 30 feet, that, that will be all of us, has a <laughs> plus 10 bonus to dexterity stealth checks and can't be tracked except by magical means. A creature that receives this bonus leaves behind no tracks or other traces of its passage. Right. That is Damn. so sexy. Congratulations, <laughs> yes, you've won Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> <laughs> and now you know how we get out of the hotels without paying our bar bill. We do. <laughs> we don't get paid for our bar <laughs> That is amazing. Uh, okay. Is that what she does? <coughs> oh, I like Seems this like band. All right, band. We are embarking again. Bark, you bark. ready to ready? embark? Yep. So you've got... Your squirrel ran away, you got a snake and a fox. I, I'm not making the squirrel come with this. Yeah. That, that's just mean. Um, the uh, the three of you who are very quiet, what are you? What do you guys want to do while you are moving forward? Are you support, you just following along? Snap. Yeah. Just support. I uh, can try to stealth. I have okay. the yeah, I'm just up there. trying to stay yeah. quiet. Okay, so. As quiet as possible. You guys walk up and Brightly reflecting from the moon is armor. Oh. There's people, like zombies, lying on the ground. Some of them are standing, and they're just, you know, in the clusters, as I said before. And some of them have cloth on, dark cloth. Some of them have bright armor. It looks like they were fallen in battle, and now they're all zombies. So, we're going to stealth like mofos. Okay, everyone roll stealth. We're going to do, yeah. Maybe we should cover. With a plus 10? With a plus 10. Do we, we have armor as well? We wear you have, you got armor. Yeah. Well, do we have, like, dark things covering our armor? Yes, we do. Cloaks and things. Okay. <coughs> so we're not shiny. We are 16. not. Nice. <laughs> 22, I rolled low. Yeah, roll bow too. Yeah. 18, I roll bow. Okay. <laughs> 31. Uh, 31, Kyle! <laughs> and, uh, 26. Uh, nice. Um, you, you said get we get plus 10. Plus 10. I have that. a plus 6. So I, I roll 21. Nice. You all make it through the first cluster. Mm -hmm. You're walking, trying not to break anything. You make it around, and you're starting to make it up. And you see, as you get closer, there's more people with armor, less people in cloth. Go ahead and roll again. 
I'm not gonna keep getting this. Oh. Oh, that's oh. oh yes. Thirty. Oh. Twenty-five. I'm really just trying to figure out how high you guys can get. We got Thirty-six. <laughs> yes. Do you keep your my the plus ten from my spell plus mm-hmm. your oh? Yeah. Then I was even higher yeah. last time. Uh, oh, 20, 27. Cool. 23. All right. What a stealthy character. Mm-hmm. Since right. I move so much faster than these guys, as I'm walking up here, I'm looking around and just kind of picking up acorns and putting them into a pouch so I can bring them back to this group. Okay. Oh. So <laughs> as you're looking around, you definitely see that there are zombies in clusters, and some of them are armor, some of them are not. But there's also weapons lying on the ground. They're covered, it's like covered in dirt and stuff, but there are some shiny bits. On the ground, there's some uh, shields, there's a helmet. As you're walking by, there's just stuff on the ground. There should be a law against littering. If I see anything that glitters with jewels or anything, I pick it up. Roll a perception check. Yep, I was going to say, I'm starting to look for money. Perception check. <laughs> I'm yeah. super focused 15 on acorns. 18 okay. plus um, 18. 18. Okay. 18. Um, 20. There's no magic, no but magic. they look like well made. 20, 20, 18. 18. Um, you don't find any money. Okay. But you guys find, what are you looking for? You're looking for gems? Shiny things. Um, any, any kind of weapons that are well, you know, encrusted with gems yeah. or anything. Um, there's no gems, but you do see a short sword that has, um, that just looks really well made. I picked that up. Okay. You so know, short is, sword. Uh, I want to pick up a short Take this. Okay, you have a shield. It's very shiny, and you pick it up, and anyone around you, like, it's very clear because it is bright, reflecting the light. Mm. Um, There's a face on it, and you guys are walking along, and suddenly, as you're walking, maybe five minutes, ten minutes in, the face starts changing to your face. Whoa. What does this mean? Yeah. No shiny bits? I could cast Identify on it. You could. Yeah. Okay, I do. I can't remember what it was called. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. The shield of things. The shield, yes. The shield of many things. Uh, how, shield. Many, how much does it protect, or how much does uh, like what is it? Does it do any? What's the moment, please? What's, what's the deal? <laughs> um, yes, and I'll get right back to you. Okay. So you have this crazy shield. Oh yeah. Oh wait wait. wait. Okay, this one is... Oh. It, uh... Oh, no, not that one. This is real Dungeons and Dragons. Nice. Uh, it gives you a uh, plus two bonus to your AC. Shields? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, it's almost like you wearing it is giving it life. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So no jewelry, no nothing? No. No, these people are out here <laughs> with purpose, yeah. Did I find anything? Um, you, what are you looking for? Um, kind of, yeah, weapon or something useful. Okay, what do you, what do you have right now? What do you, kind of weapon do you have? I have a, a regular short sword. Okay, you have a plus two short sword. <laughs> Great. Yes. Okay, so you guys make your way up, and your short sword is, is super shiny. It's like the weather had been wearing it down. Um, one more stealth check, please. Yay! 15, 18, 32, 32. 27, 16, 28. All right, this one here is like kind of steps on a twig, and everybody stops. And you hear a, but then nothing happens. Can I, can I make a suggestion? <laughs> What's that? Uh, I, I would like to cast invisibility on myself because I've got this bright shield. So uh, would, I can take you with me. Okay. How far away are we from the place? You are now at the bottom of the mountain. It's a really long walk up to that mountain that spell my last time. And as you as he steps on the twig and you're looking around, it actually clears up the mountain, 
Uh, you do not see uh, undead on the mountain. It's not another. Call you Twiggy. <laughs> so the last group of things we walked through, was there anything of note to see? No. So you guys are at the base of this mountain. It is clear walk now, about three or four more hours just to get up, and it's steep. It's zigzag. And you make your way up there, and you're a bit mm-hmm. exhausted. Yeah. But you guys make it to the top of this mountain. Yes. Uh, it is cold and snowy, and you got <coughs> a shield and some things. How many acorns did I find? You found huh? 50. <laughs> 50. 50 acorns. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> so they won't make any noise, and I put it in my bag. Cool. So you are on a ledge, and in front of you is a very ominous door. And this door has these crazy, intricate designs. And the seam of the door, like you can see the seam, but you don't see any door handles as you're standing. But you do see a little square area. Um, it's still dark. Well, it's two, three, four, five. So it's actually sun, sunrise. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's dawn. Yeah. So it's a little brighter. So what you see is, and you can see it from far behind, uh, it looks like two handprints, one on either side of the doors. It's a black door. It's like black with its like etchings, and it's like black on black. Is it a magic door? <laughs> um, nice. You smell it. You don't even need to cast it. You're just like, oh. That's a one on it. Um, um, or is that uh, bad? How, how big are the handprints? <laughs> They're big. Uh, not for me. Uh, probably if it doesn't match, it's not a good. Not yeah. pop. Yeah. It's definitely <laughs> humanoid. <laughs> Since I was up on top and I saw the guy before he ducked back in the portal, the, the lead guy, and he told us about the whites. How long do I think it would take for me to use my disguise kit to use makeup to make us all look more like whites so we look like undead? I don't know, an hour. Yeah, actually, you know, makeup artist, so probably like 30 minutes each. Uh, I can disguise self at will, so I'll go ahead and. Does anybody do else that. want it? Yeah. Yeah? Um. Mm. Just, don't they have other senses? I mean, we, can, we yeah, have a lot of disguise self like, as well. Yeah, okay. So. We don't have a lot of time because the guys are in there. We gotta save them. Wait, 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 though. How are we gonna know that it's us? Once we get no, in we there, might kill each other. <laughs> <laughs> right. Because I'm not going to make you look like somebody else. You're just going to look like you. You're just, just going to look dead. Oh. Or you would make yourself oh. look dead. Oh, okay. Look I like see. pale. And, uh, so when they see us wandering oh, no. around, they're like, why do those guys look so good? Don't they smell us or something? I don't know. I'm not dead. I don't know. How do they? What do you guys want to do? Look, it possibly you're wrong. Find out. I'd be okay. Let's okay. okay. find right. out the hard way. So, <laughs> are some of you disguising, or some of you not? I'm happy to disguise if you want to disguise. I'll cast yeah. disguise yeah. self. If they're doing I'll it fast, like if they're gonna do it fast, that's, that's okay. Bad. So we got one zombie here. Who's else is disguising? I would like to be I would disguised. Like to be disguised. Okay. Two, three zombies. It's worth it. But I can, I can cast um, my spell again. To I've keep got us great on. invisibility for when we go into combat. From but, being um, tracked. I can disguise self as a zombie. Yeah, okay. That one, uh, yeah, the passive trace. I can do that. Oh, cool. I'm assuming. Okay. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Yeah. 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 If, if you want to, if you want to, if I need stealth, to be invisible, I'll be that invisible. works. Yeah. If you want to sneak around as opposed to just look oh, yeah. different. Oh yeah, I am very stealthy. You don't have to. Okay. All right. I just like the makeup. How long does that? that Raise your hand if you want to look like a zombie. One, two, three, four. Okay. The both of the rest of you. You just want to do pass without trace. And then you're going to, okay. So click, pass without trace. Everyone has their super stealth on. Yep. Okay. So there's a door in front of you. You are high up. That wind is cold. The sun is coming up and it just warms you just a tinge. That morning smell, the dew is, is starting to fill your senses. Jamal, why don't you push the door open? Yeah. Ugh. So you go to push the door open. Is there a knob? There's not a knob. Two handprints. Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa,
Maybe it's a trap. No, we're all musicians. Have we, can we check if there's a trap? Yeah, push on the door. <laughs> I don't want to get electrocuted. Can your snake do it? Can you ask no, your snake? No, snake do doesn't do that kind of thing. <laughs> snake doesn't have doors. Can we rock and papers for it? And then the loser has to... I saw the rocks in paper. There's six. Wow. All right, I'll do it. I'll do it. Okay, okay. So you put your hand one one side, the other side. You close your eyes. As you put your hand in, the handhold, you're small, um, they actually shrink a little bit and they fit your hands. Uh And then you feel a prick on all five, all ten of your fingers. Ouch! And what you guys see is this red glowing, blood red light that just, from all of the fingers, and you hear this click, clank, clank, clank. This door has not been open for a very long time. And the whole thing is lit up and there's that big skull and bright glowing red on the outside. Mm. Good job. You have no one yeah. locked it. Okay. Yay. Thank you. Take my hands away. <coughs> yeah, you've got pinpricks on the top of your hands. Do I feel okay? You feel okay. Uh, okay. It's just like going to the doctor. <laughs> <laughs> that was easy. Yep, that was easy. See? And the door's open? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's go in our... Uh, who's our, up front? We should go because we're... Yeah, I'm going to sneak ahead and, and scout it. Yeah. All right, so you're all standing in front of the doors. You open the doors. So you're going to sneak in. Are you opening it a little bit and then going in? Or are you opening it? What are you doing? If you open it a little bit, I can sense the snake in. You can go take a look. Well, if you open a little bit, I can squeeze in, too. How tall are you? I'm three feet tall. (laughs) I'm all grown up. (laughs) What are you again? I'm a forest gnome. I love it. Okay. So you open it. You can send the snake in as well. Yep, yeah, back in. Um, send the snake in. Send the snake. Send my fox in. Too. This is loud. <laughs> FYI. <gasps> <gasps> it's massive. See just how tall this room is? This door is bigger. Wow. Yeah. And there's one. It's like the whole half of it is from there to here, right? That's one side. Wow. And and you peek your head in, and it is. Let's move this over. Oh. All right. Oh. So um, our lovely assistant here is going to push it over. Does it just slide? Oh. No, it's just water bottle. If the water bottle or the bag, oh. bag as well. Oh, whoa. Dun, dun, dun. Whoa. Oh, we can probably take the plank off, too. Oh. Ooh, nice catch. Nice save. Wow. wow, that looks so much more beautiful than I remember. Thanks, Roman Forge. That. <laughs> all right, so all of you are on that far <laughs> back door. Okay. So go ahead and put your Where minis on the back door. Look at those custom <laughs> doors. Look at those custom Ooh. doors. Man, the guys who make this stuff is really cool. I think we should say thank you. Oh, thank gosh, you. there you go. <laughs> Also, how cool is this table? Oh, oh, hammer table. table. Hammer table. Yeah, this is so beautiful. What you see before you is, Who is this a one? temple, and it is, has braziers fully lit. And at the very end of the temple, where's my bad guys? Ah, there's no bad guys. We there's win. no bad guys. We win! Yay! <laughs> All right. So oh, we're gonna take is this you? And the uh, Amore? Uh, uh, yes. And we're going to put, um, yes, we got to pretend yeah. that there's... All right, guys. This is what we have here. Yeah. I don't know how we work. What the... Oops. <laughs> I don't know what's doing. Okay. So, we've got... Oh man, I can't. I still can't reach. Um, can you put oh, we put these guys are up here? Mm-hmm. They're all talking. Yeah. Yeah, Wait, is that guy like in there? In there? Or is that the throne? Oh my God, that's the throne. Uh, yep, that is the throne. Oh my evil, God, I haven't even throne. seen all of this yet. I um, haven't seen that. <laughs> <laughs> What? You what? Look, at this this? <laughs> Look at these um these snake pillar. Oh my god. Oh, oh this is the coolest. 
Wow. I love the lights. I know. Oh. Where's my big Looks head? very evil. Okay. Evil. Yes. All right. Well, he's. Oh, oh, everything goes to jail. Okay, so he's actually in up the in throne. There. Oh, him again. Yes. Okay. okay. So is this reasonably well lit? It's got torches it's, um, everywhere. It's sexually yeah. lit. Torches. You know, it's that romantic nice sure. <laughs> that, I mean, Even sexually lit, I can still see, right? Yeah. So um, I put my head in the door as I'm trying to head in, and I see this. Roll stealth. And sure. With your plus 10. 19. Nice. And I put my head in, and I start to walk in, and I see that, and I'm like, in the back of my head, I'm like, nope. And I turn around and I go right back out the door. Okay. <laughs> the go, door is still open because there's no handle to push it back in. So. Guys, dude, it's, it's not like it made a lot of noise and just opens just, up into this room, right? You don't see the yeah. mentors anywhere, do you? No. Yeah. But he, it just opened like that much. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what would you want to do with your snakes? Uh, I asked him to go in and take a look around and come back and tell me what You'll he's saying so I can know what that is with Okay, way. so this, uh, roll stealth on your sink. Mm, 19. What bonus does the snake get? Plus 10. Plus uh, something. Yeah. Uh, snake got a 19 then. Yeah, well, I knew roll, I knew it was going to be high. So, uh, snake wanders Nine. around, there's... It's actually not as clean as this looks. It actually looks pretty ancient. Like some of the pillars were put back up, like to make it look nicer, but there's still rubble on the ground. A lot of the things look fixed, but were broken. So I'm gonna take what the snake tells me, and I'm gonna relay this to everybody by making a minor illusion of the map of this room so they can see what it looks like in small scale. Cool. Nice. Yeah. So you've got the super bad guy up there discussing things with some of the uh, these large creatures, and then you have some other creatures on either side of that lower area. And that is what you see. So did you see any of these elves with black hair in there at all? No. Okay. Um, and th this Thanks. place seems to go up and up and up and up, so the light only fills so far, but you can tell it just keeps going to the top of the mountain. Wow, wow, wow. hollow mountain. All right, so Ooh. what's the plan? I say that we just go in and kill them all. All right, well, sounds good to me. <laughs> <laughs> Like There's not a whole lot of hiding you can do. How about Couldn't that know. invisibility? <laughs> I think I, I want to cast invisibility. We, we can start that way, yeah. <laughs> You're like, ah! Oh. <laughs> how, how many times can you cast that? Uh, twice? Since, since, yeah, but since it's a, in, it's a concentration spell, you can only one. have one going at a time. Mm -hmm. So it's like, yeah. is it a mass invisibility? Or is it just... Uh, it's me and two other people. That's cool. But, that's you, great. You turn See. visible if you attack. What's you that? do. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Who's going invisible? Hang on, hang on. So if you're gonna do it, you don't get to attack for a while unless you want to get yourself. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna yeah. wait until I get myself situated, and then I'll attack. Any sorcery? Um, I'm still in the. Sure. Oh yes, yeah, so I. <laughs> My, f my thought was, I'm just going to see what a I'm fireball does when I drop right. it on those guys on the chair. Uh, that's oh, anyone else that's can a get lot in of space to do that. Yeah. Does anyone want to get in my cone of passing without tracing? Uh -huh. I'm in, yeah, in the cone. In there. We're all in the cone. Okay. Yeah, no, I can Stay in the cone. As soon as we enter, they'll see us, I guess. No, we're going to go to the cone. All right. So the door is open about this wide right now. Mm -hmm. So, do we have any large creatures, or you're all pretty stealthy and, and live? Mm -hmm. cool. We got two oh, smiles and four normal. Awesome. So, when this door opened, it didn't seem to trigger anybody. So, let's do this. Everyone, roll initiative. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Tell me what you got. Natural twenty. Nice. Well, what was your uh, bonus? Oh, um, sorry. I think it's be twenty-five. Mm -hmm. Or that's a 10 cider, not a 20 cider. Oh, wow. Sorry, 24. 19 plus 3, nine, 22. Okay, next. 24. 
Uh, which one of you has higher dex? He does. Okay. 14. I get plus four because... This is not a fast character. <laughs> At least I think that's... So, 16 okay. next. 15. Oh, sorry. 15? I'm the sidekick, so he goes first. 21. <laughs> okay. So. Okay. Um, Let's see. Now we've got. Don't run too far in. Jason. Jason. What? I'm going to hold my action because if I go in without Pass Without a Trace on me, I need to stay in your cone. Nice. Well done. Yeah. Organized. Chris. Um, I am going to... I'm invisible. And I'm going to... Uh, let's see. My speed is really fast. Uh, Seven, eight, nine. Make my way up to here. Wow. Okay, go ahead and make me a stealth check. And I'm being quiet. At advantage, because you're invisible. And I am invisible. And I'm not in her cone thingy, so that only gets me a 13. <coughs> okay. You feel like everything's going real well. It is going really well. Cool. <laughs> it is going really well. <laughs> Stefan. Gosh, well, if I, well, do we have to stay together? Is that what we're doing? Within 30 feet. 30 feet, what, where, where do we want to go? <laughs> I don't know if we can move up to the boss. Is yeah, the plan is to get as close to this boss dude yeah. and then attack? <laughs> yeah. Is that the plan? Oh, I'm all for it. Do we have a So you're not invisible. No. Right? So if you were hiding in shadows, you would, because you're you, I can just tell you, you would hide in shadows. If you're going to have Pass Without Trace, but then walk straight towards the middle, that's not going to work. Just straight, you're going to be seen. Yeah, it's not invisible. This one's invisible. Yeah. You, you have to, like, go, like, Behind up to the, the pillar. Pillar, pillar hop. Yeah, pillar, pillar hop. Pillar hop yeah. yeah. Okay. Maybe we should wait till like they do in the, this know, one is detected. First person shooter. And then shooters. go to the right. <laughs> Give him a chance to get right up to the bad guy. Here's a bore. I don't know. It's all about is anyone else invisible? Of course not. Is anyone else invisible? I don't know. All right, guys. You, you two are invisible. Yeah. Are um, you invisible? Nope. You're I'm in the standing cone. right next to you. <coughs> so as soon as we get in, we'll be spotted. And so then we'll, we'll are the three of you, you going to together? The three of you are moving together, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're going to just do that. Whenever it's Shelly's turn, which is next, you guys can all move. Oh. Oh. You're going to stick next to them, too? Okay. So, is this using? Um, the blonde, yeah. You can move with them, but you can do your action on your turn. Okay. Is this you? Yes. No. No. Mine. Is I this have a big you? sword. Yes. That's you. All right. Okay. So I would say that Hi. standing in the middle is not good. No, that's, I was just getting our minis. Yeah. <laughs> going over here. <laughs> Sneaking in behind that okay. pillar. Okay. You feel like you're hidden behind this Snake crazy pillar. turned pillar. This big chunks come off of it. Yeah. Stuff on the ground. Okay. So that is what you're going to do. Now, if you're not you're doing anything, you can move your full, you can dash. Okay. Where do you guys want to go? Up close? Why don't we take these guys out? We'll just get them, take them out on our way. Because then they'll know we're here. They're going to know at some point. <laughs> I mean, what, you want to go straight through this bad, bad guy? Then these guys will come behind us, and then we'll be attacked from both sides. I don't know this man. I don't know. Where do you want to go? I think we should take out the people on the flank. All right. So you guys are going towards the ones on the left. Uh, Jason, you're moving with them. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Nora, what are you doing? I'm going they, to they try were distracted. to uh, look at this one. I'm, He's I'm over making there. my way up and around to, I eventually want to get right behind that guy in the middle. Cool. Which one is he? If, if we create a commotion here and everybody yeah. starts running no. towards us, no, they'll all turn their backs to the invisible guy. See what I'm saying? Everyone roll a history check. Dun, 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 Except for Kyle. Dun, 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 history? Dun, dun, yeah. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. Was it Mr. Uh, five, five, two, three. Nine. Wow. That's At least it's five. 14. Okay, you remember that your yon T was going to fireball the the group up there. Oh, that's right. <laughs> 
Uh, do I know that before I moved? Okay, so then I'm going to be all the way over here. Okay. It's only a 20 foot area, so just yeah. see it. Yeah. All right, so, um, Nor, did you want to do anything else? Uh, for now, no. Okay, uh, Kyle, it is your turn. Okay, uh, from behind the door crack, mm -hmm. I go, Fireball. Oh, <laughs> okay, this is so you awesome. <laughs> Huge fireball seems to come out from the sunshine. It's just like it's one of those beautiful moments where like dust specks are flooding in from that little thing, and then. Okay, it's a save, yeah. Nice. It is a deck save. All right, so how many DC of them are, are there? Um, let me see. How many are up okay, there by the? Big the guy saves. Big guy and three. Three zombies. minions. Yeah. Big guy, three minions. Uh, he saves with a nineteen. Okay. And the minions. Uh, nice. What a way to make an entrance. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Hello. That is a 14, 3, and a 7. now. So, um, if you make your save, you take 24 uh, hit points. Tech. If you fail your save, you take 48 hit points. Okay. 48 hit points? <laughs> what kind of fire model? This is part of our latest Big stage one. show. Wow. <laughs> okay. So, um, they are all like, what? Um, you feel around you. Oh, do you want to do anything else, like move or anything? Uh, no, I'm going to stay both outside behind the door for cover. <laughs> okay. Um, you feel a pull. That's something that seems to pull you in. Oh, yeah? Uh, you, it's almost electricity, and all of you feel it. It's like, oh. like you feel the hairs on your on yourself stand up. Uh, you don't have any, I don't think. Uh, I do. <laughs> and you see that... They're all looking back at the door. They don't seem to see anyone else, but they see him. And it's funny because, like, my view is just this dude in the doorway going like this. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> me, <then. laughs> um, and yeah, you can easily hide. So he sees you do that, and the rest of you see that he takes his staff and he goes like this. But it there's like a crackling on it, and then there's a crackling in the middle of the room. And that big. Mm -hmm. But something moment. starts flickering. Looks like well. something is. You feel something wrong, like something that's not meant. Like his intention wasn't this thing, but he still has a hold of it. And it, you kind of see that his hand, this like pulse, is going from hit like his chest to the staff and back and forth. Um, and now there is a strange crackling in the middle of the room, and that's all that happens there. The, the three minions are going to rush uh, full speed towards that way. So if towards you can, the door? Yes. And that is 60 feet. How, how far do they move? 60, 60 feet. feet. So, uh, so what, uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 50, 60. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, right next to you. 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. Okay. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. And the, 50, you, 50, on 50, the 50, left 50. side over here, my left, um, you see them stand in front of the wall, ready. Oh, they're holding. Yeah. They're guarding. Right, now we are back at the top. That is Jace. We're going to move through this. All right, okay, Jace. I'm going to cast. Greater invisibility on my <coughs> which means I'll be invisible for the next ten rounds. Hello. But you don't become and, visible when you stab. And you can attack. And I don't become visible when I stab. Exactly. That's the oh. best. Yeah, yeah. that's no. why it's called yes. greater. Yes. <laughs> Should be called greater. But, greater. Um, so, hmm. These guys are <coughs> guarding. That our 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 plan was to take out those guides on the side, though, right? That was what I we feel wanted like, to do. I yeah, would take them out so they can't come behind us. When we're attacking them, yeah, but they're it holding. Looks like they're guarding something too. All right, I'm gonna go for them. Uh, I'm gonna All right, let's do this. Move me uh, in front of one of those guys. You only live once. Let's do this. If you want, I could probably take them out all on my own, and you guys <laughs> go attack those guys. Because, well, you know, the Sharon is a bit of so badass. this is True. actually taking a lot of. We should have said that already. So, so it, I'm gonna go with what we said. If you to, wanted to stick with the the plan we decided on, that's a great idea. 
but we should have said it beforehand. All right, so you're going to yeah. go in and you're going to attack. Yeah, gonna... Do it. Let's do this. Which one? One guy. Shaman. Maybe I'll disengage and Shaman. get on the front end of that, but at least for my first one. All right. Um, so you remember your the AC you're going for is oops, is very low. So you've got if you get over an eight, you're pretty great. I definitely. I did not need to do that. <laughs> that was a nice rhyme. <laughs> um, I get a um, fourteen. Yep. Okay. Hit. Okay. Great. So go ahead and roll your dice and your damage at the same time. Okay. Yeah. We'll speed this up. Uh, eight. Eight points of damage. Eight points of damage. Okay. All right. So, that is you. All you're doing. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you, c you're super invisible. They, they're looking at each other and they're like, "What's going on?" Uh, Chris, it's your turn. You're invisible. I'm invisible. Nice. So he's standing at the top with this staff all by himself, mm -hmm. not oh. seeing you at all. Oh. So I'm gonna go. 5, 10, 15, 20. Roll still. Grab the staff out of his hand. <laughs> I'm going to get a 22. Nice. And as I get to him, um, does he still seem like he doesn't see me? Yep. I am going to initiate my attack. So since he cannot see me, my first attack will be at advantage. Okay, and now you're so gonna be visible. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna punch him right in the... Right in the stuff. Ding, ding. Whoa. Really? The ding, ding. You're going, <laughs> you're going there? He's <laughs> <laughs> only three feet tall. <laughs> That's like, I'm only three right. feet tall. Are you gonna blur your blows his ding, ding? I'm gonna get armor class 20. <laughs> Yeah, it's yeah. Good. That hurt. Okay. He has to make a oh system shock roll again. <laughs> well, he's dead. <laughs> oh, he's dead. For uh, uh, five points of magical bludgeoning damage. Wow. And then I'm going to spend a key point, and I'm going to flurry of blows on him. Uh, all the same spot. Uh, ooh, not so good. Uh, armor class 10 and armor class 13. Uh, no and yeah. Uh, no and no. Okay, so because I flurried, I get the disengage for free. And my speed goes up by one, so, I mean by 10. Yes, uh, let's okay. see, 5, 10, 15, 20. Uh, that one increased my speed to 25, so I will keep moving. I just go, I, I appear, and then I'm like, boom, miss, miss, and then I go <laughs> right away from him. Um, but he sees you now. Oh, he sees me, but I'm not standing next to him. Where are you That's, going? That, that would be silly. <laughs> going towards the orcs? Uh, no, that would be silly too. <laughs> <laughs> 20, 25, right there. All right. I'm like, haha, I gotta come off your high throne. Get me. <laughs> cool, it's fun. Okay. Um, friends. I'm gonna go here. Yeah, they're looking right around there. to try to figure out where that came from. Where did what? the hit come from? My move is uh, how much? Can I move? 25. 25 feet? Five, five, five squares. squares. Five squares. Oh, well, then I'm just going to go right up here and attack this poor dude. All right, attack him. You get two attacks. You have like 18. a plus. Yeah, totally hits. 18. Uh, to maximum 12. So it's 12 plus 6? 12 mm, plus. No. He's not doing using the extra bonus, he's only plus oh. 3. 12 plus 3, 12. 15. 15. Okay. All right. So you... Oh. Comes out of nowhere. Please. He's like, whoa. All right. So you hit him. Uh, you only get one attack or you get two attacks? Two, right? You get two. Two attacks. Cool. I'm like, hello. I'm not finished. Yeah. <laughs> Four. Uh, so that's Four. six, ten. Totally hits. Oh. Told you it wasn't finished. <laughs> Six plus three, nine. nine. Okay. Uh, you whack, whack, and his friend is just astounded, stares at you, and they both are about to, uh, looks like they're about to hit you. Next up we have Chalet. Well, I'm gonna mark the one that Ziggy is in front of, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna kind of stay behind here for cover. Okay. And then hit that long bow. So my bonus is a nine, so I assume I'm just gonna hit him anyway. Yeah, oh yeah, that's okay. So we're just gonna go with that. And seven damage. 
Thank you. Are you hitting the same guy or this? I like hit, uh, no. The a other different guy. guy. Yeah. Okay, is that seven damage? Yep. They're all the same? Yeah. They're just, uh, all right. Two. Cool. Nora. All right, I am going to come up to right about here, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to poison spray him. Oh. Yeah. Poison. It's always good. Wait, who are you poison spray? This, this one. This one. Little... Oh, yeah, I can't see from here. <laughs> <laughs> right here. <laughs> Perfect. Is there only one there for you? There's only There's one. one. Nice. Mm -hmm. one. Okay, that is uh, 16. Uh, yeah, uh, that, no, I do not, I do not do anything. So, but as it's a just bonus, wet. <laughs> but as a bonus action, I'm going to Misty Step away. Nice. Cool, very well done. Okay, uh, you get it in his eyes, he blinks, he opens his eyes, he's like, where, where did she go? <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay. So next we have Kai. Fireball. Wow. Oh, yeah. Another one. Yeah. Rocket. Oh, that's a natural 20. Okay, so they make it. Okay. There's only one up there, right? No, not up at the, well, not up where the chair. Where are you doing it? The, the three guys charging me. Oh, oh the three guys. Okay. Cool. okay. So right in the center. That of the is room. 20 on one, that is 10 on the other, and a 9 on the other. So we'll say the further one back you miss, but those two right there. You got him. It's that seven ten split. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, those are always hard to get. Uh, so forty one on the ones that failed, and twenty for the one that made it save. All right, you drop those, those two. two of them. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Boom, boom. Fireball does a body. Yeah. Okay. The other one though, he shakes it off and. Still coming after you. Smoky and cindery looking as he is. Mm -hmm. Actually, he moves towards you. So mm -hmm. he's he is 30, normal. Sure. This one? Yeah. So go 30. Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Okay, so he's actually going to come right up to you. So he's going to go all the way out. <laughs> there you go. So now he is face to face with you, however, he can't do anything else. And. The bad guy, the big bad, is going to look right at you, Amore. And he is going to <coughs> laugh at you. And he starts. I didn't realize that was so funny. <laughs> it's not a good and spell. you all feel, you actually, everybody make a dexterity saving throw. Uh -oh. uh -oh. Spell save? No. No. What does it mean, a dexterity save? So you roll that, and you add your dexterity to oh. the same bonus. <laughs> Did you roll a natural 20? No, no, I rolled oh. a 19. Oh, I was looking yeah. at this. Yeah. Yeah. 7, 8. 23. Mm -hmm. You're nice. trying to 21. beat okay. whatever it is. 13. Okay. It's be higher. Yeah. Higher so what did you guys get? Uh, I got uh, 13. Okay, you move five feet over. You just move five feet. Uh, Which you direction? You guys feel, it's almost like gravity is pulling Which you in. Which direction? This way. Well, towards the, the guy right next to me. Uh, you, you can move behind him. Yes. Cool. And what appears in the middle over there is that. Beastie thing. Um, oh. You guys have heard stories. It's a chimera. It's a chimera. Oh. Where does oh my god. It's a monster. Summon something. Pretty much right where I dropped that fireball. Yep. And you saw you get pulled this way? Oh. Uh, did you fail? I got 13. Uh, no, you, you're good. Okay. You're good. Um, that one does that. It's looking around, and there's nobody near it, right? No. Cool. But what you see is it go, and the electricity is faded now, and it goes. And uh, it smells the closest person to it. So who's the closest? Mm, uh, I think it's probably me behind maybe. the door. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, who's inside yes. that's the closest? That's, oh. <laughs> uh, that's a good question. We're all pretty much equidistant. Yeah. Mm. All right. Well, there's three I'm bodies here three and three one body uh, It's going to smell the tabaxi because, mm, that fur. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while since I gave myself a Kitty. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that is what it's going to do now. However, it's turned towards you. Uh, you definitely see it looking at you. Oh, hey. Oh, boy. So... It uses other senses. And those two ogres on the left over here, they're going to attack uh, Stefan. Okay. Turn. 
Shimona. Shimona. That is a a nine. That is a fifteen to hit, and a twenty-two to hit. What's your AC? Uh, Fourteen. Okay, they both hit you, and that is. Uh, so it's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine points of damage on the first. <coughs> and then six, seven, eight, nine, 13 points of damage. So you just get hit from one funk in front on, you like spin you around one way. And then you get hit up from the other side. Thunk, and spin you around the other way. And you just. <coughs> okay. Can I say something? How many points? No, mean? it's their turn right now. Okay. Um, and then this ogre on this side looks right at you. You're, you're invisible now. Um, so it looks at you and it charges towards you. And I think it can get to you, can it? 30 feet? Uh, one, two, three, oh yes. All right, okay. it comes up and it attempts to hit you. And that is a 23 to hit. Yep, that hits. All right. And you get hit with this big old uh, morning star. Oh yeah, they have weapons now. Uh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine points of damage as it just. Okay, now it is Jason. Okay, um, now can I say something? No, it's a, okay. on the, his turn. Just on his turn. Yeah. I am going to class, uh, cast Cloud of Daggers at Fourth level Whew. on the Chimera. Right. Yeah, do no that. Cloud of daggers. daggers. Cloud of Daggers. Yeah, wow. it just is pain. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay. I gotta do this four times, sorry. What do you want right now? Right there. I want to say it. No, not for you. I was gonna yell it to the group. Uh, 20 points of damage. Ooh, mama. Yeah. So these shards. Just like, are they dancing? Like, yeah, they just, it's like a big, it's like a cube of daggers, just like, shredding cool. them up. Nice. All right. Nice. Um, it's in a it's gonna food stay processor. There. It's going to stay there for one minute. <laughs> wow. Yeah. So, unless you move it, out of it, it's going to stay in yeah. that spot. Okay, cool. So, if it moves out, it still gets a, um, the damage while it's in there, and then it moves out, right? Right. Okay, cool. All right. Thank you. Amore. How big? Um, hmm. Five feet. It's only five by five. He seems bad, so I'm gonna go ahead and continue my my martial onslaught upon his grill. Um, let's see here. So I will move right back towards him. One, two, three, four. And as I get up to him, I will take another yeah. swing at him. I am not invisible, though. All by so yourself. Nice. Regular old attack. Attacking the big guy. Yeah. I'm going to hit armor class 19. Yep, totally hits. ka you're, you're, you're once again hitting the... Uh, I am going right for where I can see the uh, <laughs> level I, I level. I'll let you figure out what that means. Uh, uh, I'm going to hit for eight points of magical bludgeoning damage. Okay, we're going to say something really funny here. Yes. If you're going for that spot, you get an extra point of damage. Okay, so nine <laughs> points of damage. <laughs> Boom! Dead. And then I will dead. spin <laughs> my thing and flurry of blows. Um, and I'm gonna, oh, hit Whoa. armor class 17 yeah. and a natural 20. Nice. Nice. Oh, yeah. Give it to me right in the jingle bits. Uh, <laughs> so the regular one is gonna be armor, it's gonna be uh, six points of bludgeoning magic damage, and the other one is going to be, the, the crit will be, yeah, you hear it popping. I was sound. laughing. Another nine. I was so laughing. What was what is the total of all of it? Fifteen, <laughs> and then the first one was nine. Um, he was going to take twenty-four points of damage. Wow. Magical bludgeoning. Hashtag and jingle bits. <laughs> and um, popping sounds. Uh, no. Hashtag, hashtag priest of ball. Drunken, <laughs> drunken, uh, I drunken master. So uh, I, I get disengaged for free, and I will keep on moving. I'm not standing in front of this guy. <laughs> One, two, three, uh, 
for. So if anybody's actually he, watching. <laughs> he's got to feel some kind of way about that. <laughs> so if anyone's watching this or if anybody can see, which I don't think your friends can see how funny and awesome this is. So you're just like this little thing running by. <laughs> and then just running by. Yes. And then. <laughs> How much damage did he take from that? He took 24 points of magical bludgeoning damage. She still can't see what's going on. Uh, no, I'm Shimon. visible. But I go by so fast. Why? Why? Shimona, it's your turn. I'm going to attack that one I injured before. Yeah. Oh. Two. So that's like eight. AC eight. Now you do have inspiration. How many of you have inspiration left? Same. So that Is means you get to re-roll. There's any way I can re-roll? Yes, re-roll. Okay. Thirteen is better. With yes. six is nineteen. It definitely hits. Something you might want to remember when you're doing your attack. If you use this, you get advantage on your attack for one round and plus five points. What? What is that? This is bonus action. I'm he gonna, can do, do uh, next time. fighting spirit. So okay, you can, you can do it now. Cool. Let's do that. Three plus two is five. Cool. Okay, five points of damage. That's your first hit. First attack. Okay, so give me the second. And and she's letting you use this so you get advantage I want to use on the fighting one. spirit this time. No, you're in did. She's letting you use it for the first attack, which is oh. all your attacks this round you get to do that with. So So I'm rolling. You get to roll it twice and take the best of the two. Oh. It's advantage. That sucked. Roll it again. <laughs> it will probably be better. <coughs> that was better. Eight okay. plus six. Eight. Yo, you're good. That's good. It's only okay. eight. You only have to hit eight. Oh. I made it easy and, and hard damage. at the same time. Oh, Max! Twelve. Twelve. Plus, Twelve. plus three. Plus three. Uh, 15. Awesome. Fifteen points and of damage. And my second action, Surge. Wait, is that a bonus? Oh, wait, it is a bonus. You can't yeah, use you it. can't use it. No. Okay. Just kidding. Seven, <laughs> seven, plus 15, so eight, nine, ten, twelve. Oh my goodness, you're whittling him away and it is working. Next up, we dead. have Papa Pa. Papa Pa, because oh. I still have uh, this guy marked. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to keep firing him. Okay. Um, 23. Oh, tremendous amounts of damage. Give it to me. Two. Oh. Well, you know what? Two, two, ones. two ones. Wow. Two it's ones. like. He's got piercings. <laughs> yes. These cool arrow piercings, yep. you know? That's cool. Well, Get the ears. You know, every, every point counts. Every single thing counts. Okay, now oh, we wait. have. Can I. What you can want? Can you reroll damage? No. With inspiration? Just no. Mm. Yeah. Um, at least I think that's true. Is that true? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's just true. Make me second true. guess, no. Marcel. Okay. You're right. You're right. Um, thank you for your question. <laughs> Good question. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Nora. I produce a, a fiery ball of flame in my hand and I backhand him with it. Oh, Whoa. yeah. Ooh, sweet. Bitch slap. Flaming bitch Roll over Nate. Wow. <laughs> uh, that is 17 to hit. Heck yeah. Yeah. Mm. That is 10 points of fire damage. Beautiful. Fiery fist. And then I misty step uh, over Yon. Wow. He's like, where did she go? <laughs> This girl keep going. This misty step. Okay. The more he sees like that, it. he is frightened and turned on all at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> Kyle, it's just like that. He probably does like it. <laughs> <laughs> that is this foreplay. As since he's right in my face, I'm just going to shock and grasp him by just grabbing him in the face. Oh. Cool. And if you want to yell face. something, you can. Uh, no, what I was going to yell before was not attack the chimera, but oh, oh. there it did. Uh, natural 20? Yeah. So. Mm. Oh, dice roll. Is that? Oh wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> For twenty-two points. Twenty-two Ooh, points. Nice. Yeah, baby. Um, this guy's looking pretty bad, but he's not dead. Nobody's dead. But dying. he's pretty bad. Yeah. They have really. Oh, they have a lot, a lot of hit points. points. I'm uh. working on it. <laughs> <laughs> They've been working out. Okay. <laughs> so. We've like got a gym that here. They going. Do, like, we all like, uh, have the bad guys now. Yoga. You've got this. <coughs> the, you've got this crazy ogre by the face, <laughs> and you're like brrr, shocking it in the face, and it's going to swing up okay. at you. Uh oh. I have an 18, 15, 15. Well, it misses because I rolled a three. And uh, 
clearer oh. complexion. But you let go so that you can move. Just even though I roll natural twenty for the next time, are they wearing metal armor? Ooh. Just need to know if I get advantage on shotgun grabs. Uh, no, no, yeah, no. Um, but you are not letting go, and you do your matrix move. Oh. And then, okay, so we've got that one. The one behind Nora is going to look around and does not see you. He's going to run around the pillar. This way? Yeah, so he's going to go 30 feet or trying to go around it. like, And then he, he's actually going like this. <laughs> he's just running around the pillar chasing he's you. coming around? Yeah, does okay. he see you? Uh, well, we see you. He's Six here. Square. What's his 30 feet? Yeah. He's right here. So, he's so he doesn't see you? Looks like it's awesome. slightly be Fantastic, dummy. Um, <laughs> and then you've got the other ones over here. Is there two of them over there? Mm-hmm. Two. Okay. Mm-hmm. So the one that's been hit by you, Stefan, is going uh, no. after you. Oh. And that is a 22 to hit. Oh, that's Ooh. a hit. Okay. Uh oh. That is a six, seven, t- seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven to hit. 11 so, points. Or 11 points of damage. And the right. other one is oh going boy. to charge doing? towards Pa Pa Pa. Oh, I'm yes. getting hurt. Getting so hurt. that one moves towards you. Yep. And that makes my uh, Yeah, the, with those oh, arrows, he knows where you one. are. It's going to hit, and that is 23 points of damage. Oh. Oh, oh no, that's, that's 23 to hit. Oh. Sorry. Oh, okay. Yeah. I got excited. Why? Why? I got my uh, <laughs> my dungeon master ego on. <laughs> Jeez. Everybody dies. <laughs> 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 16 points of damage to nice. you and, oh boy, Amore. No more. You're getting hit. Oh. With. That doesn't sound good. Okay. So this is. Uh-huh. It's not a problem with spellcasters. You don't have to be close. Um, it's true. Okay, make me a con save. That next time it's better to be close. What? <laughs> um, I'm okay. I got a six. No inspirations? Okay. No, I used so, that. So, um, this is not my strong suit. Okay. Like so I get advantage is. on three of those, but not that's the one. Okay, hold on one second. Roll one. No, wait, you're not halfway. All right, where is the? It's I have the spell right in front of me. It's Ray of Enfeeblement, and oh, uh, and it, what's the? Da- oh, it's a casting mm. damage. Sorry, nerds. <laughs> <laughs> Real D and D. Yeah. Okay. Where's the calculator? So <laughs> Okay, calculators, what is the, because I'm, I was really hoping it would just tell me, uh, range spell attack. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. that would be um, intelligence. Uh, no, range spell attack is he rolled uh, in whatever his stat bonus is for his attack spells. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, 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 I got it. Okay, whatever. okay, yeah. All right, so that is... Yeah. Okay. No. All right, this is, uh, okay, sorry. Sorry. You're going okay. to be sorry. So, <laughs> this is. So it's not, it's not rolled, feeble, but. If you rolled and you hit Raven him. Raven feeble. Yes. If you rolled and you hit him, right. then you only do half save. damage with your physical attacks until you can make a save versus con. I or only take half damage on attacks that you strength. Oh, strengths. okay, I'm sorry. On and a hit, the target deals only half damage with weapon yes. attacks that use strength. That's None of you do. Cool. Because you're all finessing. Me. Okay, that's fine. Um, but that is, I was reading it totally backwards. Cool. Okay, so he just. So he just gets very few wind. And the chimera now. is running towards the tabaxi. <laughs> and then Feebler. also, um, fire breath. Oh no, here comes the chimera. How close is, is he coming? Um, Probably ten feet away. Ten feet away. Mm-hmm. It's in a cone or a line. It that is a is fifteen foot bad. cone, so it's going to get the bad guy as well. All right. And it is a dexterity save. Uh, oh, I'm pretty dexterous. You can save. You can save this. 
take it. 24. Ooh. Yeah. Wow. That's a good one. Yeah. Yeah. Cat like this. Okay, seven. Tabaxi. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-three, fourteen, five, sixteen, seventeen, eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one points of damage, halved, half of thirty, fifteen. Okay. Okay. Nice. Um, yeah. Plural. That's a good save. Yeah. yeah. However, roll for the bad guy. Oh. No modifier. The save for the bad guy. Can I roll until I get for him? Actually, he takes it all. Oh, okay, yeah. cool. Good job. It's the one I injured, right? That's. Yeah. He, okay. He's going down. Oh, no, it's not the one that you injured. It's the other one. It's the one he Did he disengage from me and yeah. went and attacked her? No, the other one. It's this one. Really? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, the one that's, oh, that was okay, fighting so you was still yeah, fighting here. Then. Right. Yeah. This one's still. Okay. Whew. All right. My darling All right. Um, this guy would be over here. I'm going to thunder wave uh, okay. that one back into the wall. Yeah. Nothing so behind it won't mark. hit anybody but Does it. Does that affect yes. your allies? No, it's it won't. Okay, you. I believe you. Yeah. yeah. Uh, can't as far as I can tell, that, that, that green one there, if I thunder wave that one that way, it wouldn't hit my allies, right? Yeah. And I'm going to do it at a better DC of 15. Okay. The blood sacrifice. I love all this rolling. Yeah. Nope, three. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Level three. Um, so I do a second. How far does he move? He moves ten feet back, and he takes. Move him back. Uh, uh, Sixteen points of damage. Sixteen. Oh yes. So the one next is was it the one next to? You? It was the one Stephane? right next to me, the blonde one. Yeah. And I so. shot him back at an angle as to not to hit anyone. So he hits the wall, crack. Yeah. The wall cracks oh, and the flying? sculpture on it just uh, crumbles behind him, and he oh. is prone. So he's not dead. He's not dead, but Blind he's prone. not looking Blind good. Down. Okay. He's like not looking good. Oh, he's, he's looking good. Yeah. Okay. Next. Come on. Amore. All right. Amore rushes in again, uh, right up to this oh. guy. One, two, three, two. One time. And he will attack uh, yeah. with his um, strike. Once again, to the. I will only hit an armor class of 12. Uh, no. And I will still spend the key point, and I will uh, flurry of blows on him. That's just so funny. It's just. And so I'm going to hit armor class 14. Yes. And armor class 25. Yes. <laughs> Okay. Ouch. Oh God, I'm so sorry. Not 14. That's fine. Yeah. I will hit him Still once. Out. Um, my <laughs> damage is not focused on strength. It's all dexterity as a monk. So he's going to take still seven points of bludgeoning magic damage. And I will say as I continue to go by him, Master Stone Crusher says <laughs> relaxation is proper. <laughs> Is, is most important for <laughs> punching technique. Well, he didn't know what you were before because you were just a blur that just kept going back and forth. But yeah. now he knows He's what to catch you are. on. Yes. <laughs> and if you did damage, then he has a concentration check. Right. So right. Okay. Um, that would be fun. I never want to fight you. <laughs> 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 All right, Stefan, let's do this. I'm making note of it. <laughs> um, what you do notice when you're coming when you're coming back through mm -hmm. is um, the dam you, you're doing damage to him yeah. and he kind of flinches, but um, the staff starts to glow and he oh, kind of stands damn. up faster than a normal person would. Oh, that's interesting. Since the guy is prone, you get advantage when you attack him. Sure. And a uh, perception check for me. That's good to. That's an interesting thing he's a donor. Uh, uh, Twelve. Uh, you notice there's a crack in the staff. Ooh. There's a crack in the He's got a crack in the staff. Uh, All right, what you doing? Shimona. I can move how many? <laughs> I think like uh, five squares. I'm, you know, he looks like he's about to die. I think, uh, who's this? Who's your buddy? That's you can take care three. of him. Take care yeah, of him. I'll, I'll take, take care of Chimera. I got him. I got him. He wants to go kill the beast. One. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25. I cool. place myself here. 
blocking its mirror from you. Thanks. Oh. Attacking it. Attack it. Run for you. AC 14. Hello! Seven plus six. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Um, does not hit. <sighs> Is there any way you I can do it? You have two hits. You get two swings. Go ahead. That was just practice. Thirteen. Yes, plus. totally hits. Go ahead and do damage. So you take your great axe. You lift it above your head <gasps> and craps. That's maximum. <laughs> twelve. You got twelve. Oh, twelve. Twelve. Plus twelve. Six. Six. Oh, plus three. Yeah. Twelve plus three is fifteen. And you land it. Uh, Where do you land it? What I'm, 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 I'm seeing all these heads in it. I see, you know, I'm, so I'm swiping at some of the heads. Okay, what, where do you land it? In the, uh, see there's this dragon head right yeah, there. Yeah, you want to smack it in the face? <laughs> okay. You can, Choose your face. You, could, you could use your uh, bonus action to charge and do an extra five points of damage since you did run at it. Oh, do that. I was running. Yeah, do I that. I was running into it. But you have to say I'm using my bonus action to do the extra damage. Because I do my bonus action to do that <laughs> actual damage. I accept! <laughs> <laughs> so that is good. That is extra five. I'm still learning. All right. That's, That's good. Take it home. All right, next. <laughs> we have... Pa, pa, pa. Okay. So I think that this... I think this was the guy that I had marked before, because this was the yes, guy that was yes, over here. Okay. And seeing as though he's right in front of me, I'm just yeah. going to go ahead and do a little... Um, you going to move your mark? Short sword on him. Oh. It's still on him. Okay. Oh, I, I can't see what's going on. I know. Behind the pillar. Big party over here. Woo! We need to get your DM cam. Um, yeah. 19 and 21. Heck yeah, okay. do that damage. And then that is eight, 20 damage. Okay. So 20 on the guy that hit you? Yeah. All right. Stabby, stabby. All right, yeah. he's uh, getting, it's it's getting, it's working. It's working. Um, and can, no. can I use my misty step and maybe get away from him? Yeah, where would you like to go? I misty think I can go, <laughs> it's 30 feet, right? So yeah. it's five, 10, 15. I'll go over here. Okay, you. <laughs> Bye. All right, Nora, wow. it is your turn. Wow. As you are oh. comically running around a pillar. Yes. <laughs> so I, I just peek out to where he can uh. hear me, or where he can see me, and I'll go. And I put a, uh, and I produce a flame again and just slap that upside his head. Okay, do okay. it. Um, that is a 16 to Yes. Four play continues. But I, uh, I misty step over this way, just uh, behind this Two. little corner so that big guy can't see me. All right, okay. Next we Smart. have Kyle. I uh, will use another shock and grasp on the person who keeps. It's such a beautiful scene. Look at this. Just <laughs> look at it. Uh, it's like the party's dispersed and so there's chaos. AC nice 11? Battle. Yes. Four. 12 points. Perfect. Okay, that guy is, I believe. It's almost, ex it's exactly as close as the other guy who's oh. almost oh. gone. Okay, and now it's the bad guy's turn. He's gonna do that thing again where he's trying to take you out, gonna launch, actually, is he? He's super, super pissed. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> uh, he's gonna grab at you. Okay. Right. Grab at who? You. Me? Oh. Yeah, okay. so why don't you, we're gonna. Opposed? Yeah. I rolled a five. Okay. Well, that's a nine. Uh, I rolled a dirty point. All right, so you wiggle your way out, and the guy that is against the wall over there, who's around him? Can you see anybody? Uh, well, he's invisible. This oh. guy? Yeah. <laughs> he can see Ziggy, he can yeah. see Ziggy's me. Ziggy's invisible. Mm -hmm. He's oh, coming Ziggy. after you. He's, okay. Oh. So he's running towards you. Can you get it? Well, he, he would go up. right by Ziggy. Does that? He can't see him. Ziggy's but invisible. Ziggy can see him. Does he get to Oh, good job. Yeah, thank you. Yes, you get an opportunity to Because he goes right That's by right. you, and he doesn't even oh, know you. Oh, please hit him, because this is going to be great. Okay. Just roll him. I got a uh, 14. Yes. Perfect. Oh. So any damage you do is going to kill it. <laughs> oh, on his way to get That's me. That's far <laughs> more than you needed to. This is what Bang. you see. Thank you. Thank you. Pa, 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 this is what you see. You feel the rumbling on the ground. <laughs> 
you see this ogre like this, and then how do you hit it? Oh, I just, I just, I hamstring it, and so he just <laughs> okay. trips so and So he dies. trips <laughs> 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 Allowing you just enough time to yes. kind of like take a little prance up and back, and he's just like, yes. and lands right towards you. you. Okay, and so what other bad guys are there? There are the one. There's one over here. One, one over there. The, the there's one the by the door, the and then one. Behind so the, the one the over by the chimera. What does he see? This guy. Yeah. He's, oh. He sees. You Charm have just shame. disappeared. Oh, Shaman. He's looking Shaman. around. And he, right. he, can he see sees my back. Okay, oh, he's coming right at it with that big morning star. He turns around. He's and right that behind me. That's 12 to hit. Hey, guys. 12? Yes. Cross talk. 12, uh, 12 is, uh, to hit. So it does not behind? hit. Yeah. Oh, I'm 14. Yep, doesn't, doesn't hit. He's Whip. such a... Now, yeah. we've got... We've got this guy with this staff of power... And he's Ooh. going to right. going to lightning bolt. Staff of power. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. And it's Black going to deal power. all all the damage. Yeah. Okay, so targeting. he's going to one moment, please. If you have five charges. That Tamira must be hard to kill. Okay. He's going to. Give me a deck save. Okay. Here we go. Do you have that wonderful monk? If I make my save, I take no damage. 35 hit points. I'm only a certain level. Natural 20. Yeah! All right. You saw take half damage. Here goes my hairdo. Okay, so you still take damage. There's no hair up here. It's all. Okay, so that is. I need I need dice. Okay, so that's, I need d6s. How many you got? You need how many? Uh, Just do more? A lot. Here, here's four. Oh, wait, I got one. Eight, eight d6 normally. Yeah. Twelve. Are you angry? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, five six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, I need one more. Oh, jeez. <laughs> jeez. There's a crack in the wanting to do this all day. <laughs> Um, Chris Lindsay, look me in the eye when I do this. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a second. Before you roll that, oh. I, would like say, <laughs> I would like to say one little thing. Counterspell. <gasps> oh. You oh. 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 I hate counterspell. Oh. Did he, did he, I like what, that. Did he, did he what does that mean? What does third? that do? Yeah. Oh, what level do, is he casting? You have to make a check. Uh, what does that do? That's an arcana like, check, right? Yeah. But I like how you waited for No, it's just for, a, it's just, it's a, it's a, yeah. it's a, it's a, it's a, I was rubbing it in so yeah. hard, I deserve it. Charisma's insane. Is it just charisma or with proficiency? Just charisma. Just charisma? Uh, I got a 19. Yeah, I'll do it. I'm just, I'm rolling it anyway, okay? <laughs> <laughs> It wasn't, it was fine. <coughs> I don't even care. So what happened? What was what, tell what, me, what all right, so happen? actually, I don't usually play with Counterspell. Okay. So tell me what Counterspell does. Uh, so Counterspell is if someone's casting a spell, as my reaction, I can use my Counterspell to cancel the spell if it's an equal level or less, and if it's a higher level, I have to make a roll with my um, spell casting ability to be high enough to beat the difference to take wow. it out. Wow. Nice. Magic yeah. fighting magic. Wow. Good yeah. one. So well he's like, done, got wizards. ultimate electrical power going on, <laughs> and, and Mori is over there going, what? Hey, and his like, beard is kind of like going <laughs> out like that, and then all of a sudden, bloop, and I'm like, where'd it go? And you hear me? <laughs> you actually see him do this. He's like, he looks at it, and he goes, and he sees the crack. He's like, and he holds it like this, and he's looking at you. And you see that he's like squeezing it more, and then there's like more crackling happening here. Okay, so I got whew, that was amazing. Uh, now, is that just that is it like nice. a, a third level that spell? Was nice. And how many? Oh, so as long as you have spells. Oh, spell I hate you. Yeah. Okay. I like you. I like you. I like All right. So top of the round. My boy. Ziggy. My boy. Okay, Ziggy's so going go. to move to that corner right there. You want over here? No, nope, over here. This way, this way. So opposite remember. side of me. Yeah. Like right. right. Yeah. Here? Well, so that I can get, and I'm going to cast. Um, actually, I'm going to cast cloud of daggers at third level on oh. top of his head. Can you roll cloud of daggers before? 
I mean, the damage for that, so that I can give the Chimera the damage that he should have had at the beginning of his last round. Oh, I, I, it was 20 before on that one. And it just keeps going? Uh, it go yeah. It stays it, in that spot. It stays though. in that but, spot. But it's in that spot. It won't just doesn't move with, with it. I know, but doesn't it happen at the start of his turn if he ends if he starts his turn there? I think it. I think as long as he moved out of it. The it dungeon like, master is telling me yeah, yeah. damage to it. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. Yes, does damage. Yeah. Yeah. It does all those things that you say. Whatever you say is what it says. I almost took it back, and then I was like, "Let me fail, man." You're not failing. <laughs> I'm having a great time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, and I do 11 points of damage. All right, who are you on, going for? On the big guy. On the chimera? And it's, no, on the boss. <gasps> Where are you? I, I'm sorry, I can't yeah. see. I moved right there. Sorry. Nice. I moved right there, so I'm casting it right, so so casting it right on his spot. So he's going to have to move. Okay. So team, in point of fact, you are correct anyways. Oh, I remembered something. Google. <laughs> at, the, at the start of the turn? Start of the turn. Okay, so how much damage did you just do? 12? 11. 11. Okay, he doesn't look like he's doing good at all. He's like, he flinches. He's having a bad and, uh, day. Any, anyone close, right. so you're close That's to right. him, right? That's right. You can see that like ashes are kind of falling off of him, and he's gripping it. If he had skin, it would go in one. Uh. Um, all right. Yeah, Amore. All right, so here we go. Um, this is like for the last key point I have on my docket for the day. I will move in. Here <laughs> you go. <laughs> <laughs> and we're swinging Swing for the low. fences. <laughs> oh, oh my class 12 will miss, and I spend the key did point. Did you roll and a one? Floor your blows. I did not. Five. I'll let you know when you can totally <laughs> drift me over. <laughs> <laughs> However, this is going to miss, and that one's going to hit armor class 26. Perfect. So uh, one of these is going to connect, and he is going to take ooh, uh, nine points of magical bludgeoning damage. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to uh, keep on rolling. <laughs> so silly. That is uh, so running silly. Back and forth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. It's a fun thing. Stefan, your turn. Ah. What are you Are you going after the chimera? I thought you would have gotten mad at me. You're going to attack the chimera. Yeah, you're going to attack the chimera. That means somebody got to do it. Someone's got to do it. Ha! Seven plus six. Thirteen. <laughs> Thirteen! <laughs> oh. Roll it again. Someone failed math. You know. That's okay. That's why we have friends. 18! Collaborative role Plus playing. Six. Yes, totally hits! Do that damage. <laughs> Five plus three, eight. That I can do. <laughs> All right, it screams and looks right at you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, nice next we have Pa 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 The planar warrior on that chimera. Oh. Hold on guys, what is this planar warrior? Planar warrior, I'm looking at is this the Ravnica? chimera. Um, no. next what time, is this? Next time this I normal? hit that creature on walker. this turn, which I'm assuming is right now, this is a bonus action, with a weapon, all damage dealt by the attack becomes force damage and the creature takes an extra 1d8 of damage. Hot. Okay, so I did that, my bonus action. Then I'm going to run up to him, and I'm going to stab him in the butt. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, oh. Yes. 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 I rolled it, Roll assuming it's gonna, that's what I mean. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Oh, and that is a uh, 12, 16, but then he gets an extra D8, 16, and 22. Woo! Nice. 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 I think that was Xanathar's was the Planeswalker, right? Uh, oh, the, the, the Horizon Walker. Horizon Walker, yes. Yeah, it's Xanathar's yeah. Guide to Everything. It's uh, the, the Planeswalker Ranger. It did not like that at all. Woo! Right. Yeah. yeah, okay. Nora, darling. All right. Uh, I'm going to I turn around, and I see this chimera, and I'm just going to banish it. Ooh. Banish. 
Wow. It's, there's it's nothing just, that you can do, right? You can't do you your role. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. It's uh, <laughs> it's nothing you can do. Uh, charisma. All right. <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> it just disappeared. All right, you guys, we got we have a minute. It <laughs> goes. He's just temporarily oh. gone. Yes. Yes. Sure, sure. Yay! That was awesome. awesome! I don't think I've ever seen anyone do that at my table ever. <laughs> that was cool. If Thanks. it's a summoned creature, it doesn't banish Thanks, permanent permanent it. Thanks, Flaming. Doesn't it go oh. back to its plane? You don't know what it is. Uh, no, I'm just asking. Okay, so next. Kyle, it's your turn. Um, I guess I'm going to have to shock and grasp this guy one more time. I like that you haven't even come in yet. <laughs> He's in the doorway. Artillery, natural 20, doesn't, um, <laughs> doesn't do it. So. You don't want to get close. I told you, he doesn't roll lower than 15. Mm -hmm. I hate for you to be my dungeon master. Oh, you know what? I've never had him as much. Oh, no, I did. If he doesn't did. roll, oh, yeah. he doesn't roll uh, low. So 15 points. Yeah, yeah, I know he's dead. Finally! You can come in yeah, now. Yeah, you barbecued his face. Okay. And now he's like Freddy Krueger, all in the face. Okay, would you like to move? Uh, no. Uh, <laughs> he likes it there. <laughs> okay. I'll do another all right. I'll do this is nice. I'll do another <laughs> sorcery point conversion and just... Uh, okay, so the, the, bad, the big bad guy, who can it see? Me. Yeah. That's Me? Uh, Okay. Sorcerer. You've been doing a thing. Yes. So <laughs> you can see the sorcerer. You can see He's the little guy. Kids. And you can see. Uh, He's going to look at you. Sweet. Yes. I look right back. And He's going to take them For this little beam. A beam. That's not good. Uh, oh. Man! What did he hit? Not you! Nothing! He hit nothing! That's pretty low. Eight? Oh, not that low. No! <laughs> not that low! Uh, and then there's down. just the one that's looking for Nora, right? Yeah. What's that? Oh, yeah. Oh, there's one over there's here, one over too. There. Oh, okay. That one that's <laughs> looking for Nora sees what's going on over there and is goes towards you and just runs he's full got, speed. Is he going to go past No, Charm? No, not that one. No, the this other one. one. Oh, this one. Oh, yeah. that guy. So he uh, runs he towards you. Five or thirty? Uh, he's gonna go sixty because he's oh. just charging. Early. Oh yeah, he goes uh, all yeah, the way. Okay. Exactly. So he's a, uh, and the other one is gonna hit Shimon in the back of the head. Shimon. And that is a seventeen to hit. That's a hit. Uh oh. That's six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve points of damage. Ooh. You get hit and Ooh. you feel a little dizzy. Yeah, yeah, so I'm, getting, right I'm, I'm down to like here. twenty-three hit points. Okay. So we have Jason. Uh, oh, yeah. This guy looks bad. His staff seems c more cracked, and oh, he oh, just doesn't seem to be recovering this right. Okay. Uh, well, guy. I'm gonna. I've, I've got. I'm gonna dagger him one more time. I'm gonna, he's gonna hit the, his cone of daggers is gonna be. Cloud oh. of daggers is gonna be so ridiculously. He's still in it. Yeah, he hasn't moved, so he would take another it. eleven. <laughs> he would take another eleven. Okay. Uh, and then let me do it one more time at third level. Okay, I can still attack. Remember that invisible cloud of daggers I forgot about? <laughs> <laughs> because of my goofiness, you win. He'll take, he takes nineteen more points of damage. Okay, well, tell me what happens, because you just killed the bad guy. Oh! Yes. Whoa. He gets sliced into bad guy sushi, and we <laughs> all eat it. Okay, so who's standing next to him? Not it. Not it. It's <laughs> no. really nice. No, I'm, I'm kind of hiding behind a thing. You're standing next to him, right? Who? Who's who? Who's who? within 30 There's feet no of him? Well, I was, yeah, I was oh, I'm more is right, Everybody raise your hand if you're in 30 feet of him. 15 feet is, is this dude. Or 40 That'd feet. Be. Yeah, that's that, it. That, if that's next, then I'm, I'm there. Yeah. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Nope. Okay. 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40 though. 30 feet. It's oh, 30 feet. 30? 30 feet. Yeah. Nope. So just what out happens range. is... Then I'm, then I'm out of range. Um, make me a dexterity saving throw. As uh -oh. you hear a really intense crackling, you feel that gravity pulling you in. You smell fire. Hmm. You smell burning. Uh -oh. Seems bad. I got, uh, mm, you think math nine? Does that save? No, I feel like nine should save. Far away. I, I think oh. it should have, but I don't. You're think. within 30 feet? <laughs> I'm 40. I'm 
Are you the only one? He's the only one. Spam. You take 160 points of damage as the entire as what? that staff oh. of power explodes. I'm dead. What's your max? Oh, oh. I hope so. 59. Well, you went out with a bang. I can I'm just asking. Yes. As oh, if yeah. you can do a hundred and eighteen. That's a more. That's a more. So yeah. anybody looking sees a more get launched up and back and hits that pillar and kablooey! Everyone else make a dexterity saving throw to see if you're on your feet or if you're prone. Dexterity Yeah, 15. 18. 16. 16. 19. Okay, everyone else hold your ground. Um, the zombies that are left there, they are, they kind of like this, and then they fall and they blow away into dust. And the only thing that's left in this room is the body of your friend oh, man. Oh. in that corner. We will tell the tale of the crotch striking <laughs> gnome. Screw that, you can find a damn cleric. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, you found the body right. of your d- yes, can, dead can friend. Take him back. Throw some holy water on it. You can it. tell the tale after you get me raised. Yeah. <laughs> you can tell the tale after you get I will, I will Search for treasure. Walk into the <laughs> little spiritual voice from beyond the grave. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I hate you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I heard a whispering in my ear. So you guys, everybody turns. They see your dead friend up in that area. A huge explosion happens. There's rum- rubble crumbling down from the ceiling. And your young tea friend walks into the room. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's up? Hey, buddy. Nice of you to join us. Oh, I was joining right quite well. <laughs> what happened? Don't talk to me, I'm dead. He died. Oh, he, you didn't see the staff explode? He died in the explosion. I was not exploding. I'm visible now. Um, well, can we, can we get him fixed? We can try. Bring yep. him back. We have, we have, we have the oh, wait, piece of lay thunder I know what that owes means. us. If That's you okay. find the band, where's the band? Yeah, where is the band? We must search the whole place. The entire reason so we're here. Everyone roll investigation. All right. Oh. Uh, uh, I killed Can the, the dead person do a help action? You didn't kill me, you killed my character. Ooh, 19. My big person. <laughs> my big person. <laughs> 20. 19. 16. That happens. 26. Okay, everybody else does really well. But the lead singer is on his knees in tears, holding his dear friend, as the rest of you are looking around the room. Um, however you find... This? Yep. Yeah. There's no. the cages! Oh. Oh, they're not there, but they're there! <laughs> <laughs> however... There it is um, the castle. Okay? Secret doors. Just so you guys know, there are um, three cages, and they're one of the cages Two of them have turned, and they're zombies. The other two are fine. Uh-oh. Yeah. So that is the situation. You guys, what? how, okay, we only have a couple minutes left. Uh, I assume you're going to go back to the temple. The ones that you saved that are fine are cool. How do you save the the other two zombies? Douse them with holy water. Yep. Let's throw our holy water. Holy water on them. Let's see if we can just make them dead as opposed to just zombies. Does that work? Is that no, how that know. works? I don't, I don't think that's, that's how, how that works. works. <laughs> not, I, I don't really think that's how it, it works. It sounded good. <laughs> um, you do that, nothing happens. You go back down to Lathander, and you, the, the guy brings up his friend, uh, who's an actual priest, and says, <laughs> uh, thank you so much. Our, my dear friend here has a lot to learn and has also a lot of explaining to do. He's now standing upright. And just kind of like looking a little sheepish. And he's, yeah. um, but over time, and with all the gems and jewels that you have collected, you've put all the money together to raise your friend. And that is the end of our adventure. Yeah. When, when I come back, when I come out of it, I'm like, who knew that, like, his stick would explode like that. Oh, <laughs> oh isn't um, that staff of power? Those explode. Yeah. <laughs> so we have a final performance that I believe everyone can pop take in. Yes. Oh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, 
like I said before, we play lots of covers, and there's a cover song that I'm quite fond of about a, uh, na uh, written by Brig Hellclaw from Sirens of the Realm. He's hot. And uh, he would thank you very much if you were here. <laughs> but uh, this is a song that he wrote about Santa. And we can all sing. And you can, you can all sing the, uh, the chorus. Sure. Once you hear it once, you should be. Okay. okay. Yeah, so. I met an old in Snakewood and I, oh, oh. I met a crumbly gauntle gringle tried to win a bet. But then a drow who clearly won turned him into his pet. I met an orc from Glimmerwood, his future was so bright. But then he met an ogre mage and didn't win the fight. But then I met the one who told me that I could go far. That young and handsome bold beholder known as Xanathar. And he said, I've got my eye on you, I've got my eye on you, I've got my eye on you, I've got my eye on you. Well, I met him all in Snakewood and I really liked his shield, but then he met a cavalier who didn't like to yield. It seems that every path I cross is riddled with a curse, but every time I come out fine, so I guess it could be worse. And then I met the one who told me that I could go far, that young and handsome bold beholder known as Xanathar. And he said, I've got my eye on you, I've got my offshoot of Sirens of the Realms, mixed with the Dungeon Master's Guide talk show. This adventure was uh, put together originally by TJ Storm and Vivid Vivka. She's the one that named it Dwight the White. And um, yeah, thank you guys so much for playing. Let everyone know where they can find you on the internet. Hi, uh, I'm Kyle Hope. You can find me at uh, Inkwell Society on twitch.tv slash Arcana and you can also find me on Twitter at KyleVoked and Instagram at Kyle.Voked. Uh, I'm uh, Stefan uh, from DwarvenForge.com. We provided the terrain. Check it out. Yay! Thank you so much. It is absolutely gorgeous. Neat. Shad Ross and I have been designing this for the last couple weeks and it is an right. honor. I didn't see I didn't see it ahead of time. Yes, so it was I, an I'm honor. And I believe there's some that I don't know if that is a normal door, but I told him about the hands on the door mm -hmm. and he's like, I got you. <laughs> so awesome. yes. So is this a custom kit? Or can people um, buy, buy this? People can buy this, I believe. This is the snake temple. Yes. It's mostly snake temple. Yeah. It's gorgeous. I'm Shelly Mazanoble from the D&D team at Wizards, and you can find me on Twitter at Shelly Moo. And thank you. This was an honor to play on your It's an honor to play here. And thank you, Satine. Thank you, Satine. Uh, I'm Nora Ibrahim from 7th House Studios. Uh, you can follow us at uh, 7th House Studios with the number 7 on Instagram or House 7th on Twitter. Um, you can follow me personally at Norological on all the things. I'm Chris Lindsay from Wizards of the Coast uh, and head of the Dungeons and Dragons Adventures League. You can find me on Twitter at Onatrix. Uh, I'm Jason Charles Miller. You can find me uh, on almost all the socials as Jason Charles Miller, except Twitter. I'm Jason C. Miller. I host a show on Geek and Sundry called Starter Kit, where we teach people how to play, uh, new players how to play role-playing games. And I'll, you can also find me uh, every Tuesday night uh, on Sirens of the Realms. That's right. I'm Satine Phoenix, your dungeon master, mistress, whatever you want to call it, dungeon lady. Is that what you called me? Uh, you can find me on the socials at Satine Phoenix. Find me and my art at burningquill.com. I do comics and uh, nonfiction. And on Tuesdays, Sirens of the Realms, an all-barred band on tour through the Forgotten Realms.